Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Good morning, Konnichiwa. Good day, mate. <laughs> Wherever you are, I think it's like 10 a.m. PM in Australia or something like that. Buongiorno. Yes, yeah. people are watching all around the world, Lydia. Bonjour um, as well. Let's not forget the French. Okay, let's not. <laughs> Who are we missing? Howdy. Uh, I <laughs> howdy. Uh, Love the Texas language. Good. It's beautiful. Morning. And uh, Heidi, Heidi Mai, whatever it is, um, if you're in New Zealand. Well, Heidi Mai? What's Welsh? Borida. 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 Borida, if you're a Welshan. A Welshan. Uh, welcome back. It's everyone's favourite cephalopod. It's Yay! <laughs> Someone in chat is like excited. Um, <laughs> Hello. Aircon broken here, 36 degrees at 10 p.m. What? Um, Where are you in the world? Australia. Australia. I think like a, right. a, a rough heat wave. Oh, Lewis Christ. speaking Maori was painful. Oh. oh, was that? Did you say that Maori? No. Well, yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> I don't know. Because you what they say, Zealand. the only time I hear it is on Air New Zealand. Because we used to fly to like LA on Air New Zealand for yeah. some reason. And they would always assume we were going all the way to New Zealand and they'd, they'd be like, welcome to New Zealand. <laughs> New Zealand? <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 my, whatever. Oh, they say Kia Ora. So I'm, I'm Ora. half Kiwi, so I should know this, but I know all I know is Kia Ora. Because it's delicious. Um, Borada. What? Come on, I could do well. Uh, it's, the, only thing I, the only reason I know Kia Ora is because of um, the, the lovely box juice drink. I, that's a blast from the past. Yeah. Is that, that's really old, isn't like it? Like Umbongo. Umbongo, yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Those, uh, I can taste the E numbers from here. Oh, God, yeah. Did so, they, go on. No, I was about to say, yeah, they probably took it. It's probably not allowed. It's probably not good for kids or anyone's digestive tract system. Thank you for joining me <laughs> on Stock and Stuffers. <laughs> this is like supposed to be the morning stream where, oh, like, like we... Um, we relax, we play the games mm. bundle, but we've pretty much done them all. There are actually a bunch of games that I'm supposed to have played, but I haven't figured out which ones yet. Okay. Because like some people were like, oh, can you play my game? And so I was like, sure. And then obviously haven't keep, kept track very good of what people wanted me to play. Yeah. Well, that's all right. So, so today I was like, Lydia, what games uh, do you want to play? Or like games have you got excited for? And you said Two Point Hospital. So we could play Two Point Hospital. That's the thing we could do. Or we could do some um, Return of the Ob Obradin. Have you ever heard of that? Yeah, so I uh, I streamed Stocking Stuffers with... Um, Matt Castle. Matt Castle. Red shirt guy. Yeah, Red Shirt red, Guy. Red Jumper Guy. Um, and red Guy. Red Guy, yeah. <laughs> just, <laughs> He's just, more yeah. uh, colloquially known. Um, and Who spilt soup on his red yeah. jumper. <laughs> and then put it and back in to, the drawer. to wash it. <laughs> um, so he said, I asked him what his favorite game of the year was, and he said this... So I looked it up, and lo and behold, today I played Lewis talking about Oberdin. So I watched that, and uh, I thought, oh, I really want to play this because I love a I love a murder mystery. I really love. You're gonna love this murder. Okay. You're gonna love this. Let's see okay. if I can load it up. Um, Steve, can we cut the Christmas music? Can we get this on my screen? I want to be I want to be immersed. And can Steve. we turn the um, the volume up on this as well before the music kicks in? Is it really freaky? I hope it's no. Freaky. It's just good music. Oh, you ready? Yeah. Oh. I love a bit of like. Oh, I like this. So, press begin, Lydia. Oh. I'm just, we're just going to play this game because okay. I really like it. Um, right. You're going to have to just press new one, begin at the bottom. Begin. Because I've already. You've already played I've already it. solved all the fates. All of them? Well, as many as I could handle. I'm not very good. Okay. So I didn't, I didn't want to cheat. I was about to say, um, cheat. I'm a sucker for cheat. That's the worst thing to do. Yeah. So here we go. Look, 1803, the good ship Oprah Din was yep. lost at sea. Oh. Okay. It was built in 1796, London. Beautiful. With a crew of 51 men under Captain R. Witterell. His last visit, voyage to the Orient, Cape Rendezvous, unmet. You can contact the East India Company London office for in inquiries or testimony. Mm. Okay, so attention, Chief Inspector of Insurance at Claims London office. The Oprah Din has returned. Dispatched to Falmouth immediately and prepare a full assessment. It's returned. So you're going to do the insurance... Yeah. Claims you're like an insurance boy. I am Poor an lady. insurance boy. Insurance lady. I like the insurance boy. I think you could in another world, Lydia. You would be a like insurance a insurance boy. I think I could see you as like a what are they called? The people who like assess like the values of things. <coughs> like um, company man woke me up. <laughs> <laughs> what? what, 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 what like uh, there's a. 
as a like a, like a, a value that. assessor. Do I do like, I give you that kind of vibe? Yeah, like you a, a appraiser. Ah, okay. All right. Oh, I'm really bad with numbers, <laughs> though. <laughs> What's in the box? <laughs> you can hear this. Oh my god. Okay, yeah. Hoist it up in a few minutes. Okay, we the posh person. Hey. You're the posh person. Okay. I'm afraid so. That's fine. That's like we carefully. But you can pretend to be a woman, I think, from now on, because you don't really speak beyond this. I want to be. Um, I want to immerse. I want to do RP. Fully immerse yourself. All right. So okay. that's the, the the sort of local Falmouth sailor who brought you up to the Oberdin. Mm. The Oberdin. I like the art style. It's the like, art style is brilliant. It's the best thing about this game. All right. So we. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. I didn't really talk to him or do anything. We don't need to. Okay. Good. All right. That's fine. Let me just get my bearings. All I'm right. gonna keep quiet, really. Okay. Just let you sort of figure out what the heck's going on. All right. So I'm the insurance lady. And there's a dead person! Alright, how do I... Ooh. So, you can't interact with him yet. Right, okay. This is just... Um, well, he's been dead a while! Exactly, so you, you, need, you need to really use your eyes, you need to think about stuff. You don't need to worry about opening these doors yet, because no? they sort of unlock as you investigate stuff. Okay. But this is really just to sort of get you in the... get you used to, like, what the ship looks like, how big it is. Okay. There's a ship a lot like this in Bristol. Oh, um, yeah. Have you seen the, um, the SS Great Britain? Yes, I have. I wanted to go on it. They did like a sort of Halloween-y sort Now, it's got a bit like this. You see this? So this is actually a light well, effectively. The idea of this is that this provides natural light in the room below. Oh, okay. And so the okay. room below this tends to be like a state room, like a, like a, like a conference room. Um, or like a, like a meeting room with a big table. Okay. These are in here, in the middle here. Oh, that's obviously... A wheel, but that's not for steering. Um, yeah, what's that for? You can, that's like a hoist. And I think it's Let's used for, for various things. I think he wants, you, he wants you to go and get your... Um, oh, I left my stuff behind. Yeah. He was telling you, he, you said, you told him to hoist up your box, but... I just buggered off. He's, no, but he, he said he can't hoist it because it's too heavy. Okay, all right. So Oh, so I've got to get a hoist. I've got to get that hoist and hoist it. I've got to do some hoisting. I don't think... You, know, you don't have to worry <laughs> about that. You don't have to do very little do with that stuff. Okay, take take yourself about or open it here. All right, I'll open it here. Thank you, kind sir. Who's, who's this game made by? Lucas Pope. Uh, okay. He made Papers, Please. Mm. And that's the only other game he's made. Uh -huh. um. All right, show me. Oh, uh, right, here we go. Return of the Oberdin, a catalogue of adventure and tragedy, 1807. Preface. I trust that you now find yourself aboard the Oberdin. I expected this day to come, and my, uh, my every intention was to tell the ship's strange tale within the pages of this book. Regrettably, failing health has allowed me to produce only the basic outline that follows. Your presence on the Oberdin is critical. I leave the discovery of its fate and the completion of its book in your hands. The next few pages will be seen bewildering at first. All will make sense in time. Use the pocket watch to determine the identity and fate of everyone aboard. Complete each chapter accurately and return the book to the guaranteed post by guaranteed post to the French Office Affairs of Morocco. Morocco! <laughs> the bargain chapter will remain unknown to you. I possess the details within, but have elected to keep them private for now. Henry Evans. Okay, so. Journey the ship, the crew, life at sea, glossary back cover. This card of pretty cold, murder the calling. What? Okay. So those chapters are basically the, what happened kind of... Um, so here's, if you click on that, click on that picture. Mm -hmm. So this is where the ship went. Right. It left, it was supposed to go around mm -hmm. to the Cape of of uh, South Africa, right. okay? But at some point, something's happened and it didn't report in. Okay, so it left some sort of Cornwall. And then yeah, like Plymouth, I think. Plymouth and then... Same. And then went past... But we don't know where it went missing, or...? Well, it's back now outside Falmouth, so it's made it all the way back. Right. Um, this is the layout, so this is the the, the, the the four decks. So if you go to the top one, it'll be the, the, the topmost deck. Captain's the main quarters. deck. So that's where we were just hanging So the out. captain's quarters are on the top deck mm -hmm. with the passenger cabins there. So that gives you a clue. Like if you find a body in a passenger cabin, they're unlikely to be the bosun mm. or, or mm -hmm. the bilger or, you know, there you go. There's the bosun's cabin and the bosun's mate. And there's the second mate. What's, fourth what's mate. a bosun? A bo well, they're all like, they're all like terms. I don't actually know. I might have to look it up. But it's, I think it's the person who's in charge of like... It's kind of like the sergeant on ship, like okay. a general ship manager. 
I think. What's, what is a boson? There is a glossary, people are saying. Oh, cool, we might have to look that up. So scroll down. <laughs> okay. That's all right. Yeah. Uh, well, cool. he's got a store. Yeah. I think the boson right is quite an himself. important person. A ship's officer in charge of equipment and crew. So there you go. He's okay. kind of like... He's pretty important, then. I always think of him as like the sergeant, you know? He's like, uh, he's like Terps. Yeah. Terps the boson. Exactly. All right. So this is the crew. So this was the manifest when they left. So you've got the captain, various mates, and the mates are kind of in charge of like di different things. Mm -hmm. So like, the first mate would be in charge of like just just like general shipboard stuff. Second one's in charge of like I don't know like like gunnery or something like that. It depends to be different. But then there's also like stuff to do with that as well, like surgeon, carpenter. Surgeon's mate. There is a gunner and the gunner's mate. So gunner maybe they're in charge mate. of maintaining the guns. Guns, artists, passengers. There's not many passengers. They're all like just people's mates. Just brought their mates along. Top man, seaman. Sea so top men are people who climb the rigging. Okay. Sketches of life aboard. So this is Ooh. the main thing that we're going to be using okay. to like determine who people are, because this is like a. These are like sketches that were found of. Um, what life is like on board, and their faces are blurred out because you haven't identified them yet. Oh, okay. This guy is this guy nude? Um, he's certainly topless <laughs> from just like a from the waist up. Interesting. So there's some sort of Formosan royalty. And then here's all the. Oh my gosh, justice at sea. Someone <gasps> was. Someone was. Um, someone was killed. killed. And this, well, this person's really sad, and this person's comforting them. Oh my god! Did they just bloody shoot them at that close range? Christ. Barbaric. And they didn't really, that's a bit overkill, didn't really need four of them to do it, but there we go. Where do you think the captain is? Oh, uh, captain. Uh, is that the captain? No, uh, he kind of looks like everyone else. Uh, hold set, let me get my, my time on the seven seas. Remember. You were right, by the way, that is the captain. Oh. <laughs> because he's got the hat, right? So right. you can tell from. <laughs> and he's got that swish coat. He looks, right? he looks very captainly out the yeah, front. Yeah. Although he kind of does look. A lot like this guy, but he's got a longer, longer tail, so maybe that makes him more better than him. I'm not gonna like give you, but that's the kind of thing you kind of need to like sort of rough. You need to sort of take jumps, leaps of faith sometimes. Okay. Like these guys here, for example, like on the mast are probably the rigging guys, right? The rigging guys. The yeah. guy at the back there holding the the steering wheel, he's probably the helmsman. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, you know, these guys, who knows what they are, but maybe these guys around the captain are the mates. And maybe near them are the, the um, uh, sorry, they're, they're like the first mates, and maybe the ones near them are like their assistants. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, they're, yeah. they're people. You can sort of take leaps of faith if you if you want to know vaguely what people look like. Like, do I help identify stuff? Uh -huh. Anyway, I'm gonna let you go back. So is this the only? Uh, this looks like this is the only woman. Uh, there's some women at the top actually oh. as well dancing uh, over on the right. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I see them now. Okay, all right. So they might be. This guy's loving it. Wives or relatives or or passengers or who knows. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's see what they look like. Number one, a little cargo. So if you just scan through the whole book by pressing like D, um, there's a lot of chapters. You just hold it down. Um, but basically, lots of different things happened over the course of what? this journey. Oh my gosh, right, okay. And Ooh. if you go back a little bit, uh, there's some there's some terms if you want to know what they mean. Terms. Oh, okay. Foreman in charge of general crew operations, the equipment required to sail the ship. Okay. okay. Boat Botswain. So the mates, I guess, just help run the place. Mate. Oh, 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 oh. Mate. Mate. Uh, officer or tradesman that supports and assists their superior. So just it's like having an assistant, basically. Yeah. Help, help run the place. Um, what's a purser? Administrative, administrative Basically official. Basically, uh, accountant. Accountant, right. Yeah. Surgeon, uh, self-explanatory, carpenter. So guns, yeah. Helmsman, ship's wheel, steward, general staff, midshipman. So it's an officer in training, okay. Okay, so he's not quite mid. A young officer. The top man is higher rated, okay. So they're, they're the guys who handle the rigging, and seamen are just general deck hands. Yeah. They're probably in the stripy t-shirt, right? Yeah, or not. Or, yeah, or you not. You don't know. 
storage. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. All right. All right. So now you can just close this book with tab, um, and then grab the compass. So this is actually the game, really. Okay. So this kind of reminds me a little bit of a game that I've forgotten the name of. Um, oh shit! What's it called? It's you have a, a clock. Just chat now. You have a clock, and you're at a party, and the people at the party are dead, and you've got to work out who oh killed yeah. them. Yeah. What was that? What's that called? called chat. I know that. And you like rewind time, and then try and work out who murdered them. It was called. Um, I don't think it's called House Party. <laughs> Cluedo. No, no, no. No. Death I on Clock House. No, no, no. no. It's um. I know what you mean. I've played it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we've got so our... we're now going to find out how this how guy died. died. I'm loving those sort of, is it like Victorian sort of music-y? Open the door! Kick it in! Ah, lest we break it down and take more than those shells! You bastards may taste exactly what I give you! So this is how this guy died. And you need to now move. So oh, gosh. All right, so I'm... Oh, so I see. So this guy is the guy on the ground who's just been shot in the neck. Right, so and that's... This is the second at which he died. So it captures, like... The... Compass captures the second in which they died. So this guy's just stood there watching it happen. So it sounded like they were trying to get into the captain's room, which makes me think, this is the captain. Yeah, that's almost certainly the captain. Yeah, and then he's shot them. So they're trying to get something from him. Can I like interact? You can't interact with, with the no. world in this bit, but you can. But what you what you're looking at doing is trying to identify who is around. So is there anyone else in the scene? So you can't get past him. So there's no way around here. But if you head out onto the deck and look around to the left, up there, there's another guy. Uh, okay. So there's a guy up here. He's got a knife in his mouth. Yeah. Knife. So he's maybe on their team. Okay, I'd imagine so. And then he's what legged it. Cause so you need to find them. out, like, you can you can kind of figure out who's with who. Yeah. Well, so like, maybe if like, you know the first mate's involved, or whatever, or the second mate or third mate's involved, and you've identified, identified him, you could say right, who's he likely to be associated with? You know, and you can use these seconds to like see where people are and what they're doing. Okay. So if you see a guy like, in the background doing some hammering. He's probably the carpenter. Yeah. <laughs> that helps you identify him okay. for later. Okay. So, who was this who got shot? Who is this and how did they So, die? if you click on that, you say, you can click on his... This unknown soul. Right. He's got a nice hat on. So, it flags him up as who he is in the big picture. Oh, I see. Okay. So, he's a guy with a hat, for a start. And then unknown fate. Their fate may be known and can be entered. We can pretty much identify... How he died. How he died, though, right? I'm trying so to name them while their faces blood would be unproductive. Carry on and pay attention. Yeah, Lydia. I feel like I need a notebook and stuff, you know? Like, I need to, to, take the, to be the detective I've always dreamed of being. Okay, we can sort that out. <laughs> or I can just remember, it's fine. Okay, so I put in how they die, don't I? Like, yeah, how did he die? He shot. Shot. With a gun. By an un... By who? By the captain. Uh, by the captain, I would assume. But we well, we think we... so. Well, yeah. But, you know, I think you have to sort of take leaps of faith mm -hmm, sometimes. Mm -hmm. So I'm not going to say who he is because I've got no bloody idea at the moment. Okay, so if you just press back. Yeah. So this unknown soul was shot with a gun by Captain Robert Whittle. Captain, location of the corpse, three others were present. So it was this, the captain, uh, present. He oh. was shot. You flagged him up as being shot with a gun. So you might be wrong, Ooh. but I don't think you are. Yeah. And then there was that guy there. And he's the one who had the knife in his hand. Possibly. Uh, mouth. And if you scroll up and down, where was, there was another guy wasn't there in the scene. That guy was also there. Ooh. Oh, he, he could be the guy with the knife in his hand. Yeah, right, who knows? Agree. Oh, so I thought they were mates. They've fallen out over something. I reckon he's taken all the goods and he wants the good. So he's trying to get in there and then he's shot him dead. I mean, he That's said, you've got to give me the exactly stuff. Exactly what happened. Right? Yeah, he was like, give me the shells. Give me the shells. But what does that mean? Yeah. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right. So, Captain, location of the corpse. So, you three can just close your there. book now. I can just close it. Right. And um, now you've got all you can out of this scene, you can head through that door. Okay. Uh, down, downstairs? Yeah, back down here. 
It's like a, a exit door open. Oh yeah. And that basically just takes you back to the ship. This is great. It's good. As this is a really great game. I love the idea uh, and the execution of it. So you've already checked out that body. So he did. So now we've got this door open. Okay. And there are more bodies. All right. So this is just the. Old. So this tends to happen in this game. Right. So what you do is when you when when you use the memory thing and reveal like that door opening, for example. Yeah. That's that door opening the memory. It also opens in the game, so you can follow. Right. The spring. Okay. Oh, okay. So this. Right, so this so there's two out. bodies here. Um, you can pick which one you want to look at first. Okay. So. I mean, this guy has a hat. A hat. Potentially. Uh, looks like he could be a, another sort of fancy guy. And the other guy is not wearing a hat, but no. he's got a spear next to him on the floor. See if, Does he? See that spear on the left, on the right view? Oh, this, yes, okay. And there's a knife there on the floor as well. Oh. And a knife on the back. Oh my gosh, okay. So it looks like there was okay. some, some horrible fighting Fight going on here. here. All right, let's start with Fancy Man. How did this guy die? Where are they? Must be in here someplace. <laughs> there are right. The bottom of the sea. That's a lie. Okay. So. This guy is the captain. This is still the captain. I remember that body anywhere. So that's the captain. He's now naked. He was naked before, wasn't he? Was he? Uh, yeah, I feel sure. like he was he's chestless. Been, chestless? He's Top been of. speared through the shoulder. Is it but that doesn't look like he's died of it. And no. then he's been, he's cut that guy's throat with a dagger. Right. And that looks like the same guy. Who was out who was here out with here. this so guy? Go here, right, yeah. Right, so he shot him dead. His friend, I mean, his friend was a bit stupid because he knew he had a gun, but his ran in anyway. His walked in. Well, those guns only have one shot. Oh, I see. Right, okay. So he ran in. He said, give me the, I know you've got them. And he said, oh, they're at the bottom of the ocean. Quite clearly, whatever it is, is not. Oh, no, 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 it's not in here. That's fine. <laughs> You've got enough info here. <laughs> okay. So then he slit his throat. But I didn't think the captain would be dead now. I think the captain was killed by someone else. I don't. That didn't look like that spear, spear would have killed him. But maybe I'm wrong. Okay. So who is this and how did they die? This unknown soul. Okay. Well, I so we, again, we don't know who he is, but we know how he died. Yeah. So he was... He was... Scroll down with mouse wheel. Uh, he was... Struck by a... No. Wing? Um... <laughs> <laughs> he was knifed. Where's knifed? Uh, it's two, page two. Oh, sorry, I keep going too far. There we go. Uh, knifed. Uh, by the captain. I think he was correct. Yeah. Okay. okay, so hit tab. We can exit this as well. Yeah. All right. Now I want to see... So so we know that a guy and his mate were doing stuff. I'm now, trying to get something from did, what, Now, is there any sign of anyone else in the scene? So that's probably the gun the captain used to do that initial shot. Um, let me just have a little route around. I mean, that guy, oh, hello. Who are you? Oh, he's coming from behind, right. So I bet he's gonna run in and kill the captain from behind. So we've got you here, little Spider-Man over here. So do you reckon that other body is the captain? Uh, if I was to do sort of two and two, I would assume that he jumps down here and like kills him from behind, unless the captain sees him and they get into a squabble and he ends up being killed. Well, let's find out. Okay. So if you leave the room, we have to leave the scene right. and then go back in. So I go through the door? Yeah. Yeah. This is one of my favorite games of the year. I'm, I'm so glad you're into it already. This is, yeah, this is amazing. So if you look around to the right, oh, um, ooh, ooh, this guy. This is the guy. Yeah. Okay. So ah, oh, maybe this isn't the captain. I reckon this is the guy that runs in with the knife. Okay. Yeah. So why are you thinking that? I think the captain's gonna be a badass. He's already killed two people. Yeah. Bam! He's a badass. <laughs> So you s that choking at the start was that other guy who he'd cut the throat off. Right, going... Slowly bleeding to death. And then... Ooh, zoom in on that. Zoom in on him if you want. And that Ooh. puts him in, the, in where he's in the picture. Okay. Which is quite helpful. Okay. Um, so this guy, he... Um, the, the captain just pulled the spear out of his... 
right out shoulder. of his shoulder and has used it. Clocked him in the head, but got stabbed in the gut. Oh yeah. Okay. While that happened. See his little. And obviously a stab in the guts and a poke in the shoulder <laughs> looks bad. Probably not. I mean, that's got to hit him in the. What's that side? That's maybe his liver. No, the liver's on the left, isn't it? You need the liver to live. Yeah, yeah. I need that liver. Uh, okay, and he's. Where's his knife? Oh, it's knife. Okay, yeah, cool. All right. Is, is that? So that was the guy who ran up there. Oh, yes. Boom, boom, boom. So we got another dead guy. But Captain's still alive, but probably not in a very good state. So, so far, it looks like. Stuff happened on this ship where a lot of people have died. <laughs> a lot of people, yeah. And there was a mutiny, I guess, uh, against... So. There at some point, yeah. So, I mean, we are actually at chapter X, the end at the moment. Right? So we're, this so is we're, how it ends. We're currently looking at the very last, most recent thing that happened. And we're working our way backwards. Ooh. Yeah. So, okay. So, so, okay, so it's part three. Part three. So who is that? How did they die? Okay, but Might I, well I put those in. So this unknown soul. Yeah, we don't know who he is. Await further clues, right? So they can't. You can't just guess them. You have to have. Like, you can guess, but you don't want to put wrong information in because it's annoying. Screw it all up, right? Okay. Um, so we just, you can click how they died though, because that's always useful to know oh, yeah. who okay. killed them. So this is your kind of notebook, if you like. Okay, so he. Uh, he was clubbed. He was clubbed, wasn't he? Yeah. By the captain. Okay, captain is a bad. I mean, he's a machine. Okay, so that's the end of that. One other person was pregnant. Uh, okay, cool. So you pretty much accounted for everyone in all these in, scenes. In that scene, apart from we don't know what happened to the captain. So that's Well, we'll find did. out now. So if you head back out through the door. Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, this is actually the one bit of the game which is slightly awkward, but basically lets you stay in the memory and explore it further if you hadn't, if you'd run out of time on like the little... Oh, I see. Is that, so, that's, so that's timed, that bit when the... Yeah, but it's it's Spade it's just more like it, it fixes you into looking at it for a certain right. amount of time. Um, okay, so that's how okay, cool. Right. So Go. now the left hand door is open to the captain's nope, back oh. out. Sorry there, on the right view. Oh yeah. And there's a body here. Mm. And there's also what else is there? There's a sleeping dead body. Okay, well at least it seems like they went peacefully. Alright, who are you? Let's find out. Abigail, your brother, my friend, I shot him dead. I'll be with you soon, my love. Please. Forgive me. I need to write notes. <laughs> For everything. Sorry, I can keep. I can. I can. I can remind you what happened. Okay. Oh my so. god, he's killed himself. So he said, "Abigail, I killed him. Your brother, my friend." Yeah. So, all right, okay. So he's just shot himself in the face. Christ. <laughs> uh, <laughs> quite a quite gory. It's quite a way to go. Yeah. Um, but this is happening. Oh wait, so we, we get this straight. This has happened before this has happened. No, it's after. Look, this is all after. Oh, okay. I wasn't. I wasn't sure. So of, like, look, there's the blood spots. So he knew he was gonna die, and he's on a ship <gasps> in 1804. Oh, it's the. Of course, there's it's no the, way it's the, fucking the captain. captain's gonna fucking die. Right. Spot. God, sorry, I'm an idiot. Right. Okay. I got confused there. Right. We've, okay. So he's like, I've been stabbed. I'm gonna die. I shot your brother. So the guy. This is Abigail's brother. Correct. Right. So we can look on the manifest for someone who is the brother of someone called Abigail. Abigail. They have the same surname. And that will identify who he is. Okay. So but maybe. then we'll have his name. And it makes me think Abigail is the captain's wife or, you know, a bit on the side. I don't know. Because he seems to feel pretty bad about it. Yeah. Mm. So we knew who this guy is and we know how he died. Yeah. So this is 100% the captain. So if you've, basically, the game sort of tells you if you should be able to deduce stuff. But sometimes the game, it's not clear. Like, we're not playing CSI here. <laughs> like, do you know what I mean? If you're yeah, playing you CSI, like you sometimes need more information. Yeah. It's like, sometimes if a guy's in the captain's cabin, he's the captain. Right, okay. Like, so decisive information is rare. Exactly. Which is using partial information. You really do, like, often. And sometimes it's like, 
these got gu these guys are this guy, this guy, and this guy. Therefore, you you can't. Um, yeah, yeah. Is suicide suicide? Gun suicide. Okay. Yeah. All right. Captain Robert Witterall shot himself. This may, I'm pretty sure this is correct, actually. I think I'll find a... Well, I mean, because you put it in, it's not correct. But what will happen is, once you've done three correct ones, mm. the game will give you, lock them in. Okay, all right. So you can oh, yeah. change things. And you 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 can certainly just sometimes guess. Mm. Um, Did you do any guessing? Uh, yeah, some little bits of guessing. Okay. Just through elimination. But I didn't really, like, cheese it. Um, because it's not really about that. It's about if you can make an educated guess or like justify your guesses, it's easier. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Okay. So Abigail is definitely his, let's just say his wife. Um, so my love. So he killed her brother. So hit tab and just to get out of this memory. Because we know that there's not much to this one. Mm -hmm. But she's lying dead in the bed. So, oh no, I've lost her. Where'd you go, Abigail? So I'm guessing that's Abigail in the bed. Yeah. So, but then, yeah, so it's a girl. It's a beautiful lady. Okay. Right, so we'll leave this memory and then come back and look at her. Look at her body. Has she committed suicide because she's found her love dead and her brother shot? Like, she's in bed. It's a bit random death spot. Well, this is the great thing. We can find out how she died. And if it's unfortunate that she died like slowly yeah. and painfully like a, a, a later time that will sometimes be not very useful to us okay. oh yeah if it's not just like a sudden oh, but maybe how she died something different happened okay this is weird that she's in bed like I don't know maybe she took a bunch of pills and got into bed What the fuck? What the fuck is happening now? Whoa! Oh! <laughs> it's me! <laughs> <laughs> Big old squid! Jesus Christ. Right, so it's like a Kraken thingy. All right, Christ. I didn't realize it was going to be a wee bit like... So this guy's... Cool. This, this Kraken's got a few swords in it. That guy's stabbing it. Jesus. This guy's... It's this guy on the left, what's happened to this guy? So he's getting pulled by it Ooh. into the water. By the looks of it, what yeah. happened to Abigail? Abigail was getting smashed in the so face. So she's been hit by some... This is... Like... A bit of ship that there's... So it's a mast. It's like a bit of rigging right, that the, right, the squid's right. pulled off. And it's just cracked her straight smashed in the head. Smashed her in the face. Well, there goes my pe peacefully lying in bed. And <laughs> that is her. Right. And then there's this guy who's got a sword. Oh, he's got quite a sort of... He might be place. Martin. The captain. She shouted Martin, do you remember? She did, but I thought Martin... Wait, what's the captain's name again? Because I thought she said, where's Robert the captain? Robert Oh, then it's definitely not him. Right. Oh, oh, okay. So that's not Abigail. But someone else out there might be Martin. Do you see what I mean? Because right. She was like, She's like, Martin. Oh, I thought she was saying, where's the captain Martin? But no, that's obviously... No, yeah, of course, that's not the captain's name. Okay. She's like calling out for his name, but no, like... The dude. Well, you could see like... So this is a different part now. The corpse was moved post-mortem, I see. So, I, well, I don't know if this is Abigail now, because Abigail was the captain's love. But maybe, oh, Martin could be, hold that, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Abigail Witterall. So she is his wife, right? But Martin, so wait, wait, I'm getting confused. <laughs> That's okay. So Martin. she shouted Martin just just, but that could be anyone. Martin could have been her brother that the captain... No, this is happening afterwards. Well, before. This is happening before. This is before. So Martin could be the brother that he killed. Oh. All right, let me find Martin. You know who she is, right? Well, she's Abigail, I'm assuming. She's the only... Well, if, if you're saying... Martin you know, is fourth there. He's the third mate. Martin Perrot. Perrot. Third, uh, third mate is Martin. So... You just need to put what she is and how she she's died. She's Abigail. So she's definitely Abigail. And she was 
would you say clubbed? Crushed? I would say crushed. Crushed by rigging? Yeah. Okay. So she's the captain's wife. Yeah. And Martin is someone that she's calling out. But for. let's look at her name. So her name is Abigail Hoskut Witterall. Hoskut. Is there anyone called... Who would her... Hoskut. Now, we know that it's, it's someone else. William Hoskut is the first mate. So that's her brother. So that's the guy he shot. Correct. Okay. Oh, that's cool. All right. Okay. All right. So, but who's Martin? Martin, where is the... Ca oh, I see. Martin, where is the captain? Have you lost your mind? Get back inside. I want my husband. He's below deck. Come here. Right. And Martin's like the third mate. Right. So she's just calling out to that guy. Corpse was moved, which is weird. So she died there, but then was put in the bed. Um... And ten others were present. So all these women were there as well. Well, you, yeah, so now you can go back into the scene. Oh, my gosh. I've got, I've got the shades. All right. Oh, my bad. Wrong button. Um, okay, so where is she? Is she calling out to this guy? Is this guy Martin? Was she talking to him, maybe? All right, so there's a bunch of other people here. Two other women. Christ. All right. You look like the... Um, Ooh. Bloody hell. Ooh. So if you head back to where you were going. Inside? No, no, no. Or back outside? to back to back to the So basically what's happening now is like the corpse the corpse moved. <gasps> it now leaves you to like something. New. Something else is happening. Is this guy this guy's in half? Christ. Okay. So this guy's been not killed by the squid? So I think what happens is I think the um, I think the alarm goes off like this when it leads you to a Ooh, new body. So I you need see. to you need to now walk to where he died on the ship. Okay. So I think this is when like so the idea of this is like it's like it chains you to a different body. Right. Okay. I want to fill in that other guy though before I forget about him. That's okay. We okay, can, we can do that. that. Okay. So this is the guy that has been blood, Jesus chopped in half. All right, one to you, mate. Ooh. Ooh. All right, so Squiddy, Squiddy got him. He was got by the squid. Um, interesting tattoos. All right, so he's literally been ripped in half by the squid. Poor guy. But he looks like he's got interesting markings. So is that something I'm going to be able to identify oh, yeah. from someone else? He's right? very easily identifiable, yeah, he's isn't he? Covered in circles. Um, it's this guy who's using the power of levitation. Uh, Chucking a gun to this guy, I think. Chucking this guy a gun. This guy's just holding on for dear life. Doing shooting, you're already dead. I don't know who you are. <laughs> and there's a bit of a tentacle. <laughs> right, my goodness. <laughs> oh, and here's a guy with a spear. Was that the guy with the spear? Later? No, okay, right. I need to look, to not look into it too intently. Otherwise, I'm going to confuse myself. Okay. So you're kind of just sort of, at the moment, just overwhelmed by stuff. No idea. So just what put in what put put in what you right. know. He um, was torn apart. Torn apart? Is that an option? <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> By a squid. Uh, beast, I'm guessing. By a terrible beast. Okay, it's been torn apart. There's the corpse and 12 others were present. Okay. And there's more dead bodies. Okay, there's this guy on the floor. There's this one. What happened to you? So you now need to walk from where you were to the new body okay. by clicking, first of all. And then so it leads you to where he is. But it has this, like, this is a bit weird part of the game. It, like, leads you... <laughs> Takes you just in a really convoluted route. <laughs> Sometimes it does, yeah. I'm not sure. That's terrible GPS. Okay, come on. Here we go. You didn't have to be that fancy, did you? Could've just. So there's no body for this guy anymore. The point is that what you're now discovering is like 
the remnant of when he died okay. from a previous memory. So the only way to access this is from is through a previous memory. Through a previous memory. Effectively. Okay. So what you're doing is you're using one body to look at multiple look bodies. Look at other ones, right. Yeah. So you're not looking at each body's memory individually. Yeah. Because there's no evidence, because he probably was thrown overboard a long right. time ago. His body was like, or eaten by a squid or <laughs> drowned off the boat or whatever. Yeah. Like. Okay. Oh, like a powder cake. Like, oh. Love the music, it's great. Um, Jesus Christ, okay. Wait, is that the guy? Yes. So, someone threw like some gunpowder out there. Yeah. It caused an explosion. This guy got caught in the explosion. Jesus. How has he got himself up there? Was the squid holding on to him? I think the him? squid was holding him, right. yeah. Right, and then they threw the thing and he got blowed up. Alright, it's bad way to go. Uh, it's pretty pretty nasty. Right, so he's just chilling with a sword. This guy was bringing guns so up. So he's probably the gunnery man. <laughs> this is more technically known. Guy down the stairs, but I can't get to him. So this looks like it happened earlier in the attack. Yeah. Is there's people up here? It's quite it's quite barren. And it, and also he's only just bringing all the guns up. And when we looked before they were like Around. There were more people yeah. up here. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So that's the guy. That's the blown up guy. That's why we can't look at his body because it doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. He got blown to smithereens. Well, there's a bit of him on the ship, but yeah, he certainly didn't. He didn't. Okay. He got blown up. Uh, exploded. <laughs> yeah. Blast by an explosion. Okay. Get to the main bit quick. Five others saw it happen, right. Right, so that is all of the, inf that's all the deaths in this, in this that the door bit. is open right, and we okay. can leave. So if we want to re-explore these memories, we have to go through the one, through the starting one that leads the us to the others. The one, the guy that started off that switch. Yeah. Right, so there's his partial. Except we do now have like, sometimes we have access to so this, the game sort of gives you these blurry corpses, right. which are memory corpses. And that's how we would get back into the squid. Yeah, so. if you wanted to. Okay. But right. you can go in through any body to get to a specific part, right. actually. So what do we know? You might as well update the blurry yeah. information that we have. Okay. Um, how do I sort of... So you can press Q, I think, to like s zoom back the beginning. and then go forwards a little bit. Try, can I fill in... Is this how I fill it in at the crew? Yeah, you can yeah. fill it in any way you want, really. So you can click on stuff, like if you know, for example, like so, right. that William Husker, he was shot by the He captain, was shot maybe. by the captain. So do we know who he is, first of all? Well, we saw, we saw him, but is that enough to... Oh, we do, because he was standing next to him. Yeah. He was standing next to him in this picture, wasn't he? He was this guy. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Yeah. So that when you when you identify someone, so we know that Captain Robert Whittle shot himself. She was we know that she was crushed rigging. by falling rigging, and we because we already identified him through the picture. Previously, it fills in the book right. for every sighting of the same guy. Okay. Oh, that's cool. And it reverse fills in as well. So if you like identify someone at the time. Mm. It'll go back and do all yeah. the other stuff to do with them. Okay, so I guess we just like carry on what, looking around. Like, I'm trying to think if there's anything else we can fill in. So what have we got? I mean, if you look at the passenger manifest, is there anything that signifies a guy who might have like tattoos? Or also, do we know who Martin is? Martin. See, I assumed it was just the guy standing in front of her, Martin, the third mate, but. I but, don't know but who he's he not was. dead. He's not dead yet, so we don't actually know what happened to him. We do know that three people were killed, but we don't know who. And I mean, I guess any of these guys would have lots of tattoos, but God knows which one. Sierra Leone, Denmark, Russia. I'm not sure. Mm. Mm. Yes, yeah, tricky, isn't it? So yeah, you have to sort of, but again, like what you'll notice is that as you go through, as you see more people, 
you'll see more people hanging out with other people yeah, and you realize yeah. this guy was this guy so his friend was probably this guy yeah okay so you can okay. just focus all right this. okay i don't um, think we know enough at the moment to make any solid guesses the other thing i think you can do which is quite useful is um if you go back into abigail's one into her oh into her actual yeah if you just yeah. quickly go back into her one i think what you can do is um we'll read some messages while you're doing this yeah. as well um, and then you can, I'll just let you go exploring and see if you can find any more stuff. Okay. Um, but basically, if you can, like, identify people on the fly, so if you just click on her, for example. Yeah. Um, this, will, this will take you back into the very specific, the very last chapter of the Doom. Okay. So if you just press next or whatever. So if you know Martin's there, right? Ooh, okay. You hover over him and you, like, press Q or something or E or something. Hold it, hold it down, maybe. There's a button you want the key, the key you can hold down. There you go. Left click now. E, Q. There's a button like. Maybe I can do it. I definitely just did this before. Um, okay, so yeah, so if you press tab when tab, you're right. right clicking on someone's face, it will flip directly to them. Okay, open the bitwise only face to flip directly to their sketch. Okay, so. Oh shit! So go, go oh, back. Shit. Go back and do that again. So just press <laughs> press tab, right click on him. Right, right click this on him. It's quite useful tool. Press tab. Okay. And then there he is. So you were mousing over this him before. Guy. So you now know. I think that's got to be Martin. I think there's a good chance. Yeah. Of it. So she's asking him, "Where's the captain?" Where's the captain? And he's like the and third like mate. The so the third mate. One, so these pies are one, two, three. So if you click on him and oh. identify him as Martin. Can I? Uh, can I just go down like here and go like that? And then say yes. Click on his unknown at the top there. Oh, right. Memories oh, so that, that, that shows you where you're supposed to have seen him as well. Like right. if you're if you're, if you're like struggling to identify someone, it will tell you which memories they're in. Okay. So you can go back and like, if you've missed him in a memory, you didn't realize. You didn't realize it was that guy that yeah. you saw before. Right. You can like keep track of things through there. Okay. So I think you're Martin. I don't which is, which, but that's useful to to put him there, Third right? Mate, so if yeah. he see if he turns up in the future, you'll be able to like. It's just nice to have that in yeah. there. Yeah. So these are the other people who are involved. All right. Okay. These are the late. That's for Abigail, right? I don't know who these foxy felines are. And that's that guy, right? Well, how many women are there? Uh, three altogether. Four. There was that one down here who was upset. Yeah. So there's only four there's women only four in total. Women. So surely it would be too difficult to to work out figure out which ones which are which. Ones which. Well, she's older. But I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. Right. So to go back, how do I get just out? Just go again? through the door again. Oh yeah, the door. But yeah, after this, you can just like. So basically, um, I think what happens is now is like basically the ship is kind of open. Mm -hmm. And so what you can do is you can head out onto the ship. Um, and if you press like tab uh, and you go to like press Q, like go to the start, um, and you go to like loose cargo or whatever, like the first one or, or a bit of coal or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, if you press. Uh, Okay, maybe not. Oh yeah, click click there. No, okay. So m maybe if you go to the cargo deck, you'll yeah. find something which will, will trigger the opening. We'll open there. that bit up. Yeah. Because we've done eight, we've done doom, right? So. So you you don't necessarily want to go back right to one, but like I suggest you just Ooh. have a walk around the ship. Okay. See what you find. So we've done at least several parts of the doom. Mm. Um. If not all, like at least a bunch of it. So we, there definitely weren't any obvious pieces of corpse above the ground. No. But the point is that sometimes you don't need to find like a full corpse. <laughs> you can just find bit. like a little... Just a little tiny hand or something. Yeah. Or like maybe like someone was stored in a in a morgue below deck or right. something like that. And then you can piece back like mm. how they... But you need to f you need a starting place. You need yeah. like something. Okay, so if you look to go you, on. So he was part of the doom. He's the guy who got blown up. And this guy over here was the guy that got ripped in half. Let's go underneath deck. Ooh, okay. So let's just have a little wander around. That's locked. This is like kitchen area. Some cannons, very nice. Oh, hello. <laughs> 
I see you. A guy was crushed by cannon. <laughs> Holy crap. Should we watch this and then you can do some... Christ, okay. It's unlucky. <laughs> <laughs> right. So, we know how he died. Yeah. So you can actually just Squish. right click on him. Tab. I'm going to just instantly click on him. This guy. Yeah. All right. Put in like... Squished. How... Oh, actually, I guess you don't have his identity. Oh. Okay, maybe not. Maybe you have to wait till... Sorry, I thought you could put in how he died in that screen, but you oh, can't. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's interesting, because you thought... Because I quite clearly see he's dying here. Mm. Okay. So this is squished. part of the squid attack. Mm -hmm. um, so I get we're in chapter eight now. This is what's happening below deck. There's more dead bodies over there. Can you see past... Oh, there's, there's, there's guys are falling down the stairs. Falling down the stairs. Mm. There's Martin. All right, Martin. There's a half of a guy there. Oh, ooh. he's off the top half, right? There's another guy dead there behind there, oh, and yeah. a dead guy there. Gosh, right, lots of people <laughs> dying in the old so, apocalypse. So, <laughs> this is pretty rough. <laughs> um, yeah. We're playing Return of the Oprah Dinn. It's a game where you need to travel back in time to find out how the mariners on the Oprah Dinn died after the ship came back from nowhere and identify them correctly. That's right. Um, some of them might still be alive. Who knows? What's mm. the, where the first person came on board the ship. Uh, Max has bought the bundle. He says, can't wait for next year. Thank you very much, Max, for buying the bundle. Bundle is still available. We're doing this for charity, of course. Um, coming in over Christmas. Hope you guys are enjoying your Christmas holiday period um, as much as we are. Oh. Mm. So you need to find the next body. Okay, well, I mean, for this guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <I'm> pretty dead. <laughs> um, do you think this is like a kraken or like a giant squid? What do you think it is? I want it to be a squid. I want to, I want to, I'd like to think little bit of me's in this game. All right. Oh, Jesus, where are you going? I think you have to walk oh. around. Oh. Yeah. All right, and then there's another. This is pretty, pretty gruesome. I love it. <laughs> okay, so he got his head blown off. Sebastian K. Oh my Jesus. Look at that. Look at that body blend. <laughs> Jesus. So so I think what happened here was that is a cannon firing. A loose cannon. So that's So that's this is a classic term, you know, a loose cannon. Loose cannon. It's like a guitar. It looks like a guitar. <laughs> Let me just play my solo. Oh, it's this guy. It's this guy with all the tattoos. So he's he dies up there, poor guy. Um, this guy, he, is this, okay, right, I got you, so he's gonna get crushed by that, and then he's just gone bloody blown up. It's just fired off in the wrong direction, basically. It's and fallen over and killed this poor guy. I think partly because the cannon is being like, um, it's being grabbed by that beast. Right. You see? Okay, yeah, and it sort of flipped it around. So this, this is the guy that's about to be crushed by the cannon as well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, one of those guys is. We don't know which one. Holy crap! Sebastian K. Hey guys, currently studying computer science in college and hoping to join your IT crew when I'm done. Amazing. Let us know. Uh, everyone always does amazing work for charity. I'm gonna help you guys out. Thank you for the donation to Charity Dude. Uh, Oliver says, Lewis, what's your favourite tea from um, Bird and Blend? It's like the, the the Bird and Blend on the high street. I'm enjoying the chocolate digestive currently. That's what I'm. That's what I'm enjoying. So it looks like two people died in this explosion. Uh, that's why I'm a bit confused because how do I know which is blown up? Well, I think they were both killed by that same they explosion. They were both explosion. It's blown. Explode. Okay. Uh, or were they shot with a cannon? Oh yeah. Okay. I guess you're being. They're being shot by a cannon, aren't they? Blasted with a cannon by. 
cannon. <laughs> By a beast? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Just, you can yeah. just put beast in there for now. By a terrible beast. The same for this guy, I guess? Yeah. Oh, I can't see who you are. But you were shot with a cannon by the beast. Okay. So location of the corpses. One was here. They're both there. They're both there. Right, okay. Oh my God, because that's ju that's literally a blend of two bodies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Don't laugh like, Sorry. so delightedly. Right. <laughs> Sorry. I love, I love like murder mysteries and things like that. This is like right up my street. It's kind of depressing, isn't yeah. it? But it's also awesome. I love it. <laughs> All right, so and it's actually surprisingly like, um, like, the, the, like it's surprisingly like not too hard to like get back to where you were, like because now you know because a lot of this is like learning stuff. It's like it's, it's like figuring stuff out, mm. you know. So mm. if you wanted to like play this on your own, like it's not hard to get back to yeah to where you are. Get back into it, yeah. Um, okay, so we've detected another body. All blown up, but there was. Well, I'm guessing there's someone I can't see. Right, it's kind of little. Oh no, it's like he's under the other cannon, I think. Okay. That guy on the left. Guy on the left? So go back and then look under the, that cannon there. Oh, it's this guy, right, okay. <laughs> so he was must have been killed even earlier. <laughs> and he's just his body has just got squished by the cannon flying off, but he was... So click to <laughs> find the body, and then it... Right. Follow the little fairy dust. Just Imagine take you around in a circle it. back. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a little bit extra. It's just, it's just trying to get its moment of fame. Okay. <laughs> Humans are so morbid here. Yeah. <laughs> I love those noises, right? Okay, so, well, he was, he's killed by Squiddy. Squiddy so, McCoy. obviously what happened was these guys were loading the cannon. Right. Then the squid came in, moved it, grabbed, squished him. Grabbed him, crushed him. Crushed him, and then it blew off and killed these two guys who were on the end of the cannon. Oh, I love it. Love it. Right. <laughs> All right, so I know how you died, but um, I don't know who you are. So yeah, that happened, and then the ship leered, leaned to one side. That other cannon fell backwards and crushed that guy's head against oh, that. Oh Christ! Bit. This this guy over here. So one of these this guys fell back and crushed. I think it's this guy, isn't it? This bald guy. I think so. It might be the guy that guy. Yeah, what happened to? But then no, I just, so some someone survived this then. Those two died. Some poor soul actually <laughs> survived it. This is absolute massacre. Lydia loves it. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Lydia was talking about several deaths happening on the ship. <laughs> Thank you, Poo Poo Pee Pee, uh, for your devotion to charity. Thank you. Alex says, I've been watching you guys for years. You never fail to improve my mood and take me out of depressive episodes. So well, I'm sorry if we're going to put you back into <laughs> yeah, no, this isn't during the stream. Um, uh, thank you, Alex. Uh, thank you for donating to charity. Thank you for buying the bundle. Uh, Orange Mike fan added 11 bucks and 11 cents to their donation for a total of 56 bucks. Um, hey yo, Merch Mike's big fan here. Wanted to know how to get Merch Mike merch on the Yog store. Um, P.S. brought as many of the 2018 calendars as I could yesterday. Colon P. What? Merch Mike is actually going to be on stream. <laughs> In like two hours, yeah. we're gonna be playing some board games together. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. I'm, I'm, s I was a bit worried because I didn't know if you were on, if you'd received my email telling you that I was, that you were scheduled in this morning, and also because you didn't reply. Oh shit, email. I didn't, did I? Sorry. And I didn't know, and so I texted Mike last night because I don't have your phone number, and I was like, um, "Are you still on for streams? And do you know how to contact Lydia to tell her that?" Like, so yeah, it was fine. <laughs> You're here. Dead. I'm here. I'm here. Everything is fine. I was ready. Sorry, I should have replied. But yeah, I'm all. I'm all. I'm all good. He's not in the bundle. No, Mike is not in the bundle. But he's gonna be. Have you? Has he got a game sorted? You know. We're we're playing board games, right? Yeah. Yeah. He did say something. Did he message you? He said like, I thought we could play something something. Oh. Um, I don't. But I don't know if he actually me. sent it to you or not. He didn't send that to me. He just said, "See you in a bit." <laughs> 
So he's really helpful, isn't he? He's really helpful. Um, yeah. If we get more people in, we could play like code names and stuff. Yeah, it'll be fine. I think Shin and uh, Shin Mark and Hume's are going to join. Yeah, us, that'd be cool. So that'd be fine. All right. Okay, so I've got Sissy in the chat. So I said he was squished by a cannon, but people are saying, is he not squished by a beast? I think he was probably squished by a beast. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think he was was he was probably like crushed by the by the beast. beast. Right, okay. Yeah, I think he was crushed against the cannon. Right. Okay. So it wasn't the cannon. It wasn't that the cannon him. that killed him. It was the beast. I think if you if in doubt, blame the beast. Blame the beast. Okay. That's what I felt like in this okay. game anyway. Um, right. Okay. So. Uh, so we just had a door open, which means there's uh, no more we've, corpses we've seen all the corpses. here. Uh, is that the door over there? Yeah, that's the door. Okay. But that's good to know. So now we can delve deeper into the ship if we want to. Um, because like, it's, it's tough. Like We've got these people, but we don't know who they were. I have no idea who any of them are. And it's fairly hard to identify them at the point. Yeah, they're not getting any, like, the first guys had stories and names and stuff, whereas these are just, these are just dead people. All right. So cannons going off. It's all kicking off. Oops, sorry. There you go. Open the door. There we go. Uh, a little spare boat. Little spare boat. Very nice. A little writing desk. No, let me out. <laughs> there we go. Um... Okay, more cannons. Uh, are these all just going to be? Well, I'm going to look in every bloody room. Well, if you want to wait, instead of looking in every room, if you just look out look if, and see if there's any like blood stains or marks blood. on the floor or anything, that's obvious. Okay. Mm. It's a knocked over chair. That's not chair. anything much, is it? Can't be that's blood. It's just, just that's shabby. the toilet. Oh, lovely. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, nothing. Okay, assuming. I don't look in every little last thing. Well, there are bloodstains there on the floor. Look. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Or Here we go. Drop, 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 drop. And, and a there. knife. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! It's another one. What an amazing reaction to finding a dead body. <laughs> Yay! I love it. Rather than like, <laughs> <laughs> rather than like, oh. All right. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Leave me. Bear up, son. I'll stay with you. T tell Pete's mother I, I... Pete's mother. I tried my best. Aye. To pull him back, to save him. You tell her yourself. <coughs> Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit. <coughs> right. So someone called Pete has gone overboard. So, first of all, yeah. Or... Yeah, so, okay, what have we got information here? So there's a lot of blood, first of all, and that's right. his blood. This is all his blood. Where has he come from? He's been bleeding out pretty bad. Ooh. Oh, Jesus what? Christ. There's a guy here. What the? Oh, that I guy's got... head's that been guy stoved in. Face. This guy's dead as well. Oh, my God. All right. And, then and there's blood, blood leading from over here. So someone came, someone bled from this direction. But we can't go into that because that's too far out of the memory. There's a guy on the stairs. So this is the guy killing everybody? So he's listening, and this guy is coming down. Is he saying, what have you done, or is he part of this? Are they working together? So that guy listening is probably the guy who's being shouted to. Oh, right. Okay, yeah, yeah. So what do you think? Wait, okay, the guy so who's being shouted to? Wait, I've got confused. So, he was, so there was some shouting going on there. Oh, okay, all right. So what we're going to do is we'll find out here at Watch. So... So, sorry, banging this. So this is a different chapter. Mm -hmm. This is the escape chapter, which comes after Doom. It's but after Doom. War end. So Doom was eight. Because they got rid of the squid now. Well, this is part six. So this is before no, this the squid. No, this is nine. Part IX. Oh. Well, Chris Q, you can go back to it. I'm but confused. Like, Why does that say part six? Because. It's part six of the thing. So look, so, okay. So oh, this is the end. Oh, okay, right. This was the Doom. So Doom was seven. Right. And so the Doom escape. happened first. I got The yeah. squid attacked. And then there was this bit, the escape. And then that was the end. And, then and at the end, there wasn't very many people left on the ship. That was just the bit with the captain. It was the captain killing himself. Yeah. And the, the, so this must be the mutiny. Escape. 
Okay, right, okay, I'm with you now. Are I'm you following you. that? Yeah, I'm with, I'm with you. So right. if we pan through to the bit that we just did, it's the sixth part. Okay. So we've identified so that. We, so this is... So what happens? So if you just click on that, guy, that's the... The oh no guy? Oh no, your cart, don't leave me. Bear up, son, I'll stay with you. Tell Pete's mother I tried my best to pull him back to save him, which makes it sound like he w fell overboard. So what happened in the doom? Uh, oh, yeah, okay, there was squid, squiddy McSquiddy pulling people off and killing people. And Yeah, who do you think Pete might have been? Someone, someone who fell... Well, there was someone dragging someone? Or yeah. So... I'm not going to give you any clues, but, but yeah. Someone was dragged... A, a crossed by a guy. Wait, I'm trying to think. Was there someone who was like pulling, trying to keep someone on board? Is Pete the guy with the tattoos? No. Tell Pete's mother I tried my best to pull him back to save him. You tell it yourself. Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit. Okay, so, so all right. Who's so that might be one of the guys outside. Who's going who's, like that? Yeah, possibly. So I would I would guess that was the case. Okay. Um, so, so how did they die? Is this the guy on which what guy is this? So this is the guy who's lying on the floor in that cabin. Right. Okay. So it looks like he's been stabbed. Well, uh, maybe maybe we don't know actually, but yeah, he looks like he might have been. It looks knife, like because there was a knife on the floor outside. Yeah. And who was he knifed by? I we don't know. Don't know. So we don't know who he was, but where is he? He's in look look at the location of the corpse. He's in the midshipman's midshipman. cabin. Right. Does so that, he, mean? that means he's probably a midshipman. He's a midshipman. Right. So if that was. Oh. So I can't do we it. don't know who he was yet, but right. we could we could guess that he might be Where's a midshipman. The midshipman. So we can say unknown midshipman, possibly. Can you? Oh, I see. Because there's like, all right. Do you see what I mean? So you right. can like make okay. little notes yourself. Okay, I got it. So you. this, if you click the midshipman, oh wait, further clues again. Sorry. Uh, sorry, just try anyways. Um, you'll see there's three midshipmen: Peter, Pete, Thomas, Pete. and. Oh. So he's talking about someone he works. So his with. fellow midshipman so probably fell off the ship, and he tried to, but he couldn't. And he, and he tried to pull him back, and so he's either Thomas or Charles. But we don't know. And does that mean? Let me just check something. But he might not be. But the fact that he's talking about a midshipman and he's in the midshipman's yeah. cabin is like quite a lot of clues that he's probably a midshipman. Which makes sense, Peter. So when he got stabbed, he crawled back into his own cabin. Which seems like a thing that you would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Someone right? that you're familiar with. Uh, okay, no, I can't see. I was wondering if that guy's mum was on the ship, if she was like some working on it, but I can't see someone with the second with the same surname. Mil as Pete Milroy. So I guess he just means in general. Tell her. Okay. Um, okay. Oh no. Location of the corpse. Three others were present. So so one of these guys he was shouting to. So it's either this guy, or this guy. Oh. oh, that's the old fire alarm. Oh, this guy. Yeah. So, so as you can see, we've seen these guys before. This guy was clubbed to death by the captain. This is the guy that was... This um, is the guy with the knife in his mouth. He yeah. jumped over. Okay, this the is this guy. Loose. And this is the guy <gasps> who was knifed by the captain. So this is the guy who was with... So I think the these, these guys are bad guys who killed... Those people lying on the floor. There's that guy. Who, one's got his face bashed in. Oh, okay. There's one with his face bashed in, and there's one who's just dead, and that's that guy who's stabbed. And there's those two, and they're listening out. I think they're like evil murderers, and they're going around killing everyone because then they barge into the captain's thing. I don't think he's listening out like, oh, he's calling. F he's calling for help. I think he's like, shit. Like, well, no, he's so. If you go back yeah. in the memory, you know that this guy shouts. Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit. So he's... So this guy who's been stabbed is on their side. Right. He's, he's on... So, okay, so if, you, if, we, if we go back out... So the guy bending down next to him, we know who this is, right? The guy bending down next to him. That's... Um, it's the other guy in the memory. Which one is that again? This guy. No. The guy who gets shot? No. Yeah. Okay. So... Oh my God, sorry. It's a lot to take in. <laughs> it is. Sorry. So... <laughs> We're going to get another Memento okay. Mori because there's right. loads more bodies here. Okay. But, right. but we can kind of tell what happened already because we recognise this guy, right? Mm -hmm. He's the first mate. The one that got shot by the, the captain, captain right at the start. The brother of Abigail. Or right at the end. Yeah, yeah. the brother of Abigail. So he is now 
consoling this dead midshipman as he dies. Right. This midshipman was stabbed because there was that knife, that was that knife which is no longer the there, level. but he definitely like was stabbed. This guy is listening out. So this so guy heard Brennan is go Brennan. Get the thingy. And this is their other ally. So he's come down, right? You see. So they're on the same side. So this guy, this guy, and these two are in. They're cahoots. all the. They're in case. Right. But we we don't know at the moment if they're in, they're trying to help. The, well, but I we don't know whether this guy was on their team or this guy was on their team. Right. Okay. We don't know who's killed who. Right. Okay. There's just a bloodbath. This is an absolute bloodbath and two dead bodies. Right. Oof. Oof. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what happened to this poor This guy. guy. So this is the guy who was lying next to the faceless guy, right? What happened to you? What's all this Oh, okay. What's all this, you damn fool? So this is the guy that we're going, uh -huh. He's smacking him. Oh! But he just blew his head off. Right. Right. Okay, this makes more sense now. So he's killed him, who are this poor guy is. Um, and then he's come along and bashed him around the head, saying, what the fuck are you doing? And then this guy is running down to help old Stabby McGee. Right. Who's crawling his way back He's into crawling the crawling his way back. Uh, okay, right. So there you go. There's there's William Hoskett. There's Hos Hos what's his name? Rob William Hoskett. The first mate. First mate. Without his hat on. Yeah, who's following this midshipman who's been stabbed. But it looks like he was stabbed earlier, so... Well, it's all coming from here. So did this guy stab him and shoot him? Is what... You know, before he, got. before he got smacked around the head and died himself. <laughs> Christ, it's a horrible <laughs> ship ride, isn't it? <laughs> it's, it's just be a word to want my money back. And then, <laughs> yeah, this is not the first <laughs> class ticket I've paid for. This was not the leisure cruise I was sold. So who is this? How did they die? I guess we don't know. It's okay. hard to tell. So His face is blurry, so we don't know who he is. Or at least we're not even supposed to be able to identify who he was yet. But we know he got clubbed. We definitely know he got clubbed. Yeah. And we know he got clubbed by someone. But we don't know who... Oh, Brennan. He got cl clubbed by Bennett. Brennan. Yeah. But uh, who is that? Is Brennan... I mean, I assume... Is there someone called Brennan or is that just like a nickname? Mm, well, now it makes me think that that's just a nickname. Brennan, 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 Brennan. Brennan, 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 Brennan. Uh, ah, there you go. I think it's him. Boom. Okay. Oh, we don't know. I sound like you're sure, but I'm going no, with it. That's good. That's I'm going right. with it. I think that you have to start writing stuff yeah. down at some point, like especially if you feel like you've been given information. Yeah. What's all this? You damn fool. Three hours of present. Location of the corpse. More bodies. More bodies. Well, there's this guy. This poor sucker. Oh, God. Is that like his head over there? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, um, Texa. Hey, Lewis. Hopefully you see this message. I uh, had no idea you played Town of Salem until I saw last year's stream. So, yeah, I definitely played Town of Salem. And also, this year, I played Throne of Lies, which is in the bundle. Um, I played it on uh, one of these morning streams with Radders. It's actually really good fun. Uh, so if you like Town of Salem, you'll, you'll hopefully like that. Um, you've got to break out the werewolf. Oh. Oh, God, right. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. So you can't really tell who who's, was shouting who's saying and who what? was saying what. Yeah. But from what it feels like, it feels like someone was hiding. Okay, so someone was hiding, like, down here. Down here. 
and they heard, they overheard a little snippet of conversation that said, We're going to take over. And we're going to, yeah. Sirens. We're going to yeah. take the, the shells and fish, fish. I think it's fish. And yeah. sail east and sell them for gold. Yeah. Because he can't trust the captain. And right. obviously, some guy came out, yelled mutiny. There's a mutiny, and then they're like, oh, it's a, a fresh bastard. There was some sort of scuffle. So is he the guy that shouted it's a mutiny? So maybe he's, I don't know whether the, whether he shouted it or what, but certainly there was a scuffle. And it was two people talking to each other. So there's only three people there. So was one of the mutiny people? So click on the, the dialogue right. again. Oh yes, look at the dialogue. Uh, okay. The dialogue was... All right. Enough. Captain cannot be trusted. You have a plan. So it's two people talking to each other. Yes, we take ship and sail east. Trade wretched fish and shells for gold. Huh? Who's there? Mutiny, mutiny. It's a fresh bastard. No. Okay, so it's two people talking. We have three people in this scene. Two people are talking and one of them is against the mutiny. By the yeah. fact that he's shooting him and he's been stabbed. Wait, God. All right, let me use the power of deduction. Uh, all right, answer. There's two. <laughs> so they're on the same team. So he's mutinying, the guy with the gun, and the guy who stabbed is mutinying. The guy <laughs> mutinying. The guy who shot is the guy who heard them. Yeah. Is what I'm guessing. Maybe. Right. Because I think that they'd be in it together because they were in it together because he said, Brennan, get the health pack. Or what? That's not. Yeah, that's get the surgeon's game. kit. Yeah. Um, well, we know how he died. So Do we yeah. know who killed him? Uh, that was Brennan. So Brennan killed him. Brennan shot him again. Brennan's fucking killing everyone. He did. He is a bastard. Right. All right. So we don't know who he is, but we know that, well, I get, I'm assuming he was shot with a gun by Brennan, who was like on one of the last pages, wasn't he? Was he? Yeah. Brennan. Okay. It's what I think anyway. I'm not sure. Right. Six others were present. Where were all these people? Well, we might have to have a look around the scene in right. a second. Right, okay. So I might just be making assumptions. There's more bodies as well. Right. So is that definitely Brennan there? Like, can we see his face? Maybe. Just hold down and um, right click. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I think we actually need to find the body. Sorry, there's another body. Right, okay. Is the body... I'll just check that. I mean, there's all this blood. I find that weird. It's blood. That is weird. Here. There's blood there. Where's this other body? Is it upstairs? Should I go upstairs? Yeah. Okay. Ah, there's the other. Oh my god. Okay, right. There's other people up there's here. Loads of shit going down. And there's a oh. guy being fucking chucked over the edge. Ouchie. What happened to this guy? Right, okay. Now, what is going on up here? God. Okay. So let's go and find out. There's a lot of information here. No, oh, I'm getting confused. Let them go. This is Pete. I tried to save him, but I couldn't. I think I'm getting Brennan confused with someone else. So I think I've... Oh, that's a that's a that's a beautiful lady, and someone else getting. There's the first mate. There's, that's what we recognise him. William Husker. William Husker. That's the captain. That's the captain, yeah. There's Gollum. I was about to say that's the eagle, yeah. Uh, all right, there's a guy on the left, isn't there, as well, pushing off. So it looks like this oh, yeah. is like a, this, this is like a life. Escape. They're trying to get away. God, okay. And they're not, they don't want him to let him go. Someone shouted, let them go. Let them go. But he's been shot, or she. I can't really tell who's next to him. God, I think I need another coffee for this. <laughs> this is, but you really got to like, get your, your, your thinking cap on. Okay. Location of the corpse. 
Let them, let them go. Wait, I need to, need to read that again. Oh, <laughs> that's just what I said. Uh, so someone said that. Let them go. go. We don't know who no. said that. And this is the... Uh, who did I look at? This was the person being thrown overboard, wasn't it? No, mm, it's the person, shot. the person who got shot. It's yeah, who was shot. his body was being thrown overboard, but right, that's how he, he died. Right, he was shot. Okay, I, I got, but I don't know who did it. Yet. That woman shot him. Yeah, but I don't know. This she could be one of a few people. Who else was present? So who else was there? Uh, so both women. Both were there. women were there. That guy who got clubbed by the captain. That guy who was shot. Oh, this is the guy. And then we've got like, that's the guy who's stabbed to death. Sure, that's Brennan, but I'm not even sure. I think I might have got Brennan a bit confused, if I'm honest. Um, suicide, shot by his captain. And then these guys. So this is, okay. All right. Oh, Jesus. I'm not sure who's who with these women. I don't know who they are. Right, let them go. So someone was saying... Let them go. Like, don't kill them. Yeah. It's all right. We can have a walk around a bit more. So, there's more bodies. Okay. Oh, but she looks like... Oh, no, I don't know. All right. So, there's someone dead on the ship with her, on the boat with her. Or at least cowering. Or cowering. It's kind of hard to tell. Actually, yeah, you're right. It's, I think that might just be like... But there's another dead body. Ooh. All right. He's getting shot. He's dead. So, sometimes you can't... You need like a specific memory to be able to see from a specific angle. Okay. Okay. So this guy was being dumped off the ship after that after that incident mm -hmm. happened. But there's no lifeboat there now. Right? Right, it's gone. The so lifeboat has gone. Last one. Move quick. Boy, you'll not take the last one. All right. So. There's both women are on. All right, both women are on. A man with the moustache and this guy here. Who, put, who was up higher the last time, Jim? He was up slightly higher. He was higher. one sort of like almost trying to get it off. So she says. Paul. She calls him Paul. And then he's obviously. This guy here looks like he was on her side. Yeah. Because she's like looking at him and reaching out to him. And then this guy here climbed up with a gun and then got shot by her. Yeah. So she then. So what? She sure. She sure. She saw him. Get, get stabbed, stabbed and then went down got the gun and shot him so this is paul so yeah if you hold down right click on him and tab you can then see where he appears so he's this guy so if you click on him see if you can identify him he's as paul, paul something but there might be more than one paul oh, see what okay. i mean uh, da, 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 da. so yeah there you go scroll paul. up there was a paul oh was there I don't miss. oh paul, paul moss. moss paul moss so he's the first mate shoot from where possibly I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for it. I say it's Paul Moss, and he got stabbed. Oh, we've lost him. Can I? Um, you can't say how can't he died yet, but that, yet. that'll be okay. in the next screen. Okay. So, could this be? She calls out his name. Let me just. Um, oh, I can't right click. Can I? can I right click? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm losing. I'm losing her. So I'm just gonna check that there's no women with the second name Moss, just in case they were married. Right. Um, that makes sense. Paul Moss met an unknown fate. Well, he got sta uh, stabbed, didn't he? Yeah. So he was knifed, but I don't... Maybe he was killed with a sword, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was like a... Uh, By someone we don't know. We don't know who it was, do we? No. All right. Uh, case of cost. I think it was this woman. It looks like this woman. High rating means that it will be more difficult to deduce this person's identity. Focus on the easily deduced identities first. Leave the more difficult ones for later. Okay, I know, but I just want to look at the girls. 
Uh, they're quite far at the bottom. I think mm. they're passengers. Uh, oh, maybe in the middle. Emily Jackson. Emily Jackson. And Miss Jane, Jane Bird. Okay, well, not related to him then. Um, interesting. I reckon she's Miss Jane Bird because she just looks older. But I see. I, that would well, but Miss be could guess. be the younger one, Oh, that's right? true, actually, Miss Jane. Yeah, and she could be... Yeah, that's true. Okay, well, I won't. I'll leave it then because I don't really know. Okay. So, Kill by Sawbone, Anno Taka. He's trying to help the two women and two guys get away. What was the dialogue? Um, last one, move quick. Oh, you'll not take that last vote, so that's that person. Paul, look out. Stop, let them go. No, damn. Okay. So he's part of the mutiny. They're just trying to get away. So he's the first mate steward. So he's actually the first mate steward. First mate steward. And we know the first mate Wait, is sh- Liam was the first, which Walker. Was, was he the one who was shot by the captain? Yeah. Yeah, he's the guy who was shot by the he's captain. The so he's the sh- leader of the mutiny. Right. Oh, so he's trying to get away. Like, is he like... He doesn't stand by what his um, miss would be younger, someone says. Miss means unmarried. Yeah, that makes sense, actually, isn't it? It'd be missus. Okay, so, all right, so she's probably the other woman. Um, right. I don't know. Well, you do know. I actually don't. I can't <laughs> remember hardly any of this. <laughs> okay. Because, like, this is so, there's so much confusion yeah. and tricky. Like, uh, you just sort of pl- plug it in as you go along. So she's like, no, I'm poor. That guy, there's another woman there. Where's the next body that you can see? Okay. Uh, okay, wait, it's definitely just checking. Just checking. There's nothing. No one else is dead over here. This is all good. It's all gravy. This is the captain. This is the captain saying, Stop! And he shoots up in the air like a warning shot. He's got a knife. No, a bat. Is that Brennan? So let's just flag him as Brennan, because yeah. yeah, that's definitely Brennan. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oops. You have to find the, the next right, body. Is it down there? Yeah. Right. Okay. This is where all that blood was coming from, but we couldn't go in. Is that right? Yeah. yeah who is this? And you're going to have to go find him as well. Okay. Mark Perry, a.k.a. Mr. Nim, bought the bundle. Thank you very much. Had to wait a while to get it this year, so I wanted to give a huge shout out to the whole Yorks family. Thank you. Thank you, Mark Perry. Uh, Olaf Roast um, donated. He says, Zylush, be quiet and let us look at your cheese-eating, clomp-wearing, water-draining, wimble-loving, ice-skating, tulip-growing, but handsome face. P.S. Love you all. I think that's a message for Silas there. <laughs> Kieran says, take my money, you sack of bar stewards. Thank you very much for your buy the bundle. Uh, thank you Gabe uh, I'm always 20 been in Yorknot for 8 years loved every bit of it you're all saints P.S. Uh, I need a job I've got a nice smile and I have good vibes we always need some good vibes man yours, you sound it's, perfect it's miserable here <laughs> put me down let go oh, easy now oh. you're in a bad way is this squid oh it's me where is my Frenchman the squid's gone your mate was torn apart put that Beast is dead. How? How did you kill it? Yeah. We didn't. It left with the storm. The captain came up from the hold. Said he chased it off. <coughs> you should rest. A curse like that does that it for nothing. That was a lot of. A lot of information with that one. So this guy, first of all, who is he? And what do you know about him? Christ, why was his arm? All right. Um, He's got... He's trailed off his blood. So what did you learn from all that dialogue? So, okay, sorry. Uh, So he... um, He wanted to know where his other Frenchman was. So he's French. There's another French guy on there and they're friends. He said verdamped. Verdamped. That doesn't sound French. No. So he sounds... So he's foreign, for a start. He's this guy. He's this guy. Which is a particularly strange role to have on the ship, do you not think? Look at his hat, what look is, at his style. What, what's the... What's the yeah. Look at his position. He looks a bit weird, doesn't he? He does look a bit weird. So who do you think he might be? So click on him. 
Well, no, we can we can just no no no. no. Um, search. Go back. Go back. Right click. Right click. Tab. Tab. Click on him. Click on. Who do you think he might be? Um. That's it. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Could it be Olus? He's so like he's standing with the gunners. So he's got a specific accent, and he's got a a, a nice hat. So like he's he's gonna be from somewhere like that isn't English speaking, yeah. right? And obviously he's Sounds quite a really prominent rich. role in that he's surrounded by people who are interested in like and he's like you know he's and he's got also he's got so if you go back to the dialogue as well. Um, so we might have to wait for this one to time up, but basically he said, where's my Frenchman? And then the guy said, um, your mate your mate is dead. Your mate is so dead. So he has a mate who is French. Right, okay, right, okay, all right. So we can probably figure out who he is from that, right? Right. So if we look in, if we do do him again. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, uh. So who's, whose mate is French? Uh, right. He's the both boson. Exactly. So he's got the boson's hat from on. Austri yes, of course. He's the boson. He's Sorry. from Austria. So he's Alfred Clestil. Right, of guy. course. Of course he is. I and am then slow. <laughs> that's fine. No, but the like, <laughs> thing is, like, this is a thing where if you read the dialogue, you would have like totally realised it, but I'm just helping you okay. because I'm, I'm cheating. That's good. I like it. Uh, right. So he is this guy, but he, this is like he's missing an arm. I don't really know. What, so the squid's what killed him? his arm? Exactly. He like just... Just got it ripped off. And so one of the other people that we saw die from the squid is the French mate of the Bosson. Or how do you say it? Bosson? Yeah, possibly. Okay. Met an unknown fate. Let me read. I need to read this again. Put me down. Let go. Easy now. You're in a bad way. The squid. Where is my so Frenchman? So the X's mean he said them. Okay. The squid. Where is my Frenchman? The squid's gone. Your mate was torn apart. So one of, oh, there was a guy who was in half. It was literally a guy who was in half. So I'm going to assume that that's the mate, the guy that was literally in half on the top deck. Verdemont, the beast is dead. How? How did you kill it? We didn't. It left with the storm. Uh, a curse like that does not lift for nothing. Okay. So I'm guessing the squid ripped his arm off. Because he says, the squid! So otherwise he'd be like, that bastard cut my hat, my arm off or whatever. Okay. So yeah, he he, he died. Uh, so put his death in. Oh yeah. Just because we think he, I think scroll down. I think he like he expired. Expired. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh, right. oh, no. <laughs> it How was a beautiful, died? peaceful death. With How was his he arm? killed then? I don't know. It's not obvious, is it? Was he like torn apart? I mean, he did have his arm. It's, he didn't have an arm, did he? Is bled out like an option? I don't know. Like, did he Poison like shot, speared, spiked, strangled? What is it? Struck, suicide, torn apart, eaten, electric slide, exploded. I think I had trouble with this one as uh, well. Crush, no club, clawed, burned, axe, alive. We're definitely not alive. I'm going to leave it as torn apart by a terrible beast for the Just moment. Just for now. Just because I mean, he's missing his entire arm. That's been ripped right off. Um, five others were present. So the people that were with him was the captain, the first mate, Brennan. Well, this guy was shot the by The guy Brennan, was, anyway. who was... That midship. stabbed. The and actual guy. And then this the guy who was, was clubbed, clubbed by Brennan. By Brennan. Oh, I'm still... I think I might have got Brennan a bit confused, though. I'm, still, I'm not sure about my... No, I think you're right on Britain. Oh, is that okay? That guy who... Right. Yeah, so if you right. just scroll back out. Okay, so now we can have a wander and okay. have a look at these other people All in the right. room. So this guy, we don't know who he is. We no. don't know who this guy is. But, but he's got there. quite a distinctive cap on. Well, he's, I think he's the guy who got shot in the face. Um, right, that guy. Okay, yeah. Because these are the guys that came out. Yes. You see. Right, because they heard them... The mutiny, the mutiny guy. So he expired at this point and is dead. Right, These so are the two dead. guys that came out hearing the mutiny. This guy got shot in the face, in the face. by Brennan, and the other guy was was clubbed, clubbed. by Brennan. Right. What we think? We assume maybe one of those guys was actually killed by the other guy. And this is this is Brennan. 
This is William. This is no, you're right. Hosner. Sorry, this is, this is the first mate coming this out of his office, coming out. and then he's going to talk to someone, isn't he? So this is. These are all the mutiny lads. Well, you can you, you can have a look. So right click on that guy. And hit tab. So this is one of the midshipmen. Uh, so this is the, this is the guy who got, got stabbed. The back. All right, this right. is the guy who got stabbed. Coming out from underneath. So I think what happened was he spoke to the midshipmen about the mutiny going on. Yeah, they had a little chat. And they then these heard. guys heard it was a mutiny. They came out. Does one of them have a knife? One of them knifed him in the back. Yeah. Um, and the other one got shot in the face. And I think Brennan then came down. So the captain is there. I think this that's is, the is captain. This is the, the captain because he got the long coat. So he said he. So so what the what the bosun just said was that the captain said he dealt with the beast or whatever. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, but then the guy's saying, well, that's 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 probably that's not what happened. Probably not what happened. You can't just lift a curse by that. So he ca captain's going upstairs. These two are meeting, saying, screw the captain. We're taking over this ship and going elsewhere. He dies. They over here come out, get into a fight. He gets stabbed. He gets bludgeoned and he gets shot in the face. Yeah. Okay. Right. So can I put that in? Can I put them all in? Yeah. So if you right click this guy. Right click and tab. So we know he was shot by a guy. Oh, Brennan. so we've so done we've that. Flag that. We've done that. He's, already he's like done. There. This guy. Uh, this he was guy clubbed by Brennan. Is clubbed by Brennan. So yeah, we've already. We've we don't know who that. they are, but we know how they died. Right. Okay. This guy, we know he's the Although, boatswain. He was Sorry. killed by a terrible beast. But where he was? Where was he standing? So he was kind of a, the the main lads, isn't he? So if you look all of the um, yeah, he does look like one of the main lads, doesn't he? He looks quite important. He's got a, like an official sort of cap on, and he's standing with all the first mates and the captain and stuff. So he's he's someone. He important. looks like he might be important. Yeah. yeah. So we don't know who. Okay. Um, and then so, oh, but I don't know who stabbed. Like you've got a gun. No, you, that's the table leg. Who's got a knife? Does, I can't. Neither of them are obviously holding a knife or have a knife on them. Or is... That's a gun. That's a gun, isn't it? Yeah. So maybe he got his gun taken off Taken him. off him and then shot in the face. But yeah, okay, it's not obvious who stabbed him, though. You don't have anything with you? Yeah, because he, does he doesn't have a gun, so I'm assuming he took it off of him. Okay. I don't think he did any of the killing. We can go through the door now. Yeah, let's though. go through the door. Okay. Um, so yeah, there's there's a lot to unpick here. So obviously, what happened first? So did that mutiny stuff happen first? Oh, because there's all the stuff that happened on the top with the people trying to get away. Yeah. And then that guy's had his arm ripped off. Oh my god, there's so much going on. And then there's the f I think that guy who was ripped in half on the top deck is the French, French. Uh, exactly. Uh, guy, four wayward souls disappear during the events of this chapter. The fates catalogued here. Who is this? What fate befell them? Who is this? Oh, these are the two women. Yeah. See, I'm thinking that she is Emily Jackson and the other one is Miss Jane Bird. Okay. So I'm just going to do it. But I don't know what happened to them. Well, we don't. We didn't. I haven't seen anything happen to them. Who is this? I don't know. I've got no bloody idea. Oh, he was one of the ones by the boat. So it's saying the end has happened, and I haven't given faith. So these, to these are people. these are the guys who escaped the boat, or yeah. didn't escape, or drowned, or whatever. We don't know. We just don't know what happened to them. We don't have bodies. We don't have identifying marks. We don't know. We, the compass doesn't show how they happened. Maybe they survived and escaped. But because where? that is an option, isn't it? You can say they're alive. Yeah. So obviously, we need to find out where the ship was at this sort of time in the journey, mm -hmm. and say that perhaps they're alive here, or maybe like some other thing will reveal. So maybe they are... So this is where we were. Right. Oh, my bad. So they're sort of near the Canary Islands and... What's the nearest one? Madeira, Madeira or the Azores? Madeira or the Azores. Either or. They're sort of right at the back of the spam. Yeah. Back in the middle. Okay. I think this is a good a good spot to... Have a little break. Have yes, a little break and then come back. Um, we are delving deep into the mysteries... <coughs> unpicking this this thing so yeah i guess that if we just go through this like so first of all he came up having been mauled by a beast then uh this guy was there was obviously an escape going on upstairs he was stabbed um the guy who stabbed the guy was shot and then downstairs this mutiny started happening mm -hmm. 
Um, this guy was shot by, we think, Henry Brennan. Yes. This, then this guy who did the, this guy was clubbed. By Henry Brennan, maybe. And then this un unknown midshipman died in his cabin. And that's the body we found. So that's where we start. So there's yeah. six deaths here and four escapes. So we'll try and unpick this a little bit when we get back. Yeah. And we'll read the other messages. If you want to get your donations in, go for it. Um, Christmas music along with Lewis giving violent <laughs> deaths to the crew. That's what we're dealing with. All right, we'll be back in five minutes. See you, See you a bit. Thank you. 
Hello everybody and welcome back to Jingle Jam 2018. Um, me and Lydia have been playing Return of the Obra Dinn. Uh, we'll carry on playing a little bit more of it, I think, for the next hour. And then we'll play some board games. Uh, we've got some, some donations in. Thank you very much to Levi. He's bought the, the, bu the bundle. He's donated to charity. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much to uh, Darkian Maker. Uh, he says, hey guys, love the streams uh, and love the amount you rake in for charity. Thank you very much, dude. It's a pleasure to do this. I absolutely love it. And um, this is really great. So, yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, we're going to... Um, I don't know where we are. I think we'll have a look and see. I think the game's pretty much opened up now. So, Lily can just decide whatever she wants to do when she gets back. We've got the Oprah Din here. Um, exciting. Oh, it's got a it's got a certain vibe to it, hasn't it? This place, you know, certain. It's got a certain way about it. Oh, oh yeah, this is this is the cannons. Oh yeah, I remember. Yeah, there's plenty of action on board this ship. There's plenty of oh, I got a big blood slate, a big blood stain here. <laughs> a big oh. Blood trail. I might have to. I might have to leave this for Lydia to discover. <laughs> oh God, there's even blood on here. <laughs> Jesus. Um, thank you, Stanley Sturkin. Says uh, here's seven bucks to add to my donation to get thirty-five bucks and buy the bundle. Thank you. Um, how was Festarg for everyone? Yeah. How was? Did you? Uh, did everyone have a nice Christmas? A nice fest Festarg day? Oh, Festarg season. Um, I guess it's still the season, technically. It's allowed to be. Um, Shadow Rogue One, there's no blood if you push them. Uh, yeah. Well, Steve was rocket. Lydia was something by something. That's right. Yeah, she was. Um, what? She might come back. She might not. Uh, Lydia was pushed by an eight year old eight year old Lebanese child. Amazing. Great joke. Uh, exploding Waffle 101. A murderer always receive, returns to the scene of a crime. Yeah, that's I'm like alive. basic CSI level <laughs> info, isn't it? <laughs> like, 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 that's the first thing. I used to watch all of CSI. Oh like, yeah, all of like these murder shows and NCIS, and I just, I think I just watched all. They're so like American TV, though. You can just turn them on at any point. I don't like them. Putting it right out there, I am a firm lover of like. British um, murder mysteries, like I've watched all those as well. Poirot, I mean, I'm that's a classic. Very obsessed with Poirot. But also, like, have you watched? Um, there's loads of them. Like, is it like Broadchurch? Broadchurch is great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and like, loads. There's loads of them like that. And, like, I watch all of that. All of that. Good. I've watched stuff. all of Luther and Sherlock and all Luther's those. Luther's good. Great. Did you? Uh, oh, there's something. There's a new Poirot one in the moment. If anyone's watching it. A new Poirot. This is, this is relevant chat. Uh, John Malkovich is playing Poirot at the moment on BBC, ABC Murders. Whoa. Yeah. John Malkovich. John Malkovich is Poirot. I don't know. I don't personally agree with it myself. I'm furious. I'm absolutely livid. But um, New Luther soon, TM. Yeah. I, s I heard there was a new season of um, Black Mirror. Yes. Is it like today it maybe? Teasing. Or like at least like might be t might be today, but it might not be. I don't know. But yeah, so who is the pusher, Lydia? <laughs> Tell us before it's too late. I've, I'd, I'd, I'm worried about what will happen to me if I reveal, you know, reveal what I know. Exactly. Okay. You want to be careful. <laughs> so there's basically like. Um, do you want to do a little bit, and I'll. Well, no, I, can, I, I want you to see what you want. So I'll, I'll let you decide. So there's obviously all these other chapters that you can choose. Uh, loose cargo, bitter cold murder, soldiers of the sea, unholy captives. And the way you can start them is often by looking through and it'll say that this is to be found on the cargo deck. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So where are we at the moment? I think we're on the... Are we this escape? I think we're on the oh, we second deck. So this is the gun deck, yeah. So so this is where the cannons went horribly wrong and this killed the boys died. with the cannons. And this is where we found... This is where everyone was shot in the mutiny mm -hmm. and dragged his body back. And so we haven't been down to the all-op deck yet. Okay. Oh. Or, oh, shit. We've got loads. So there's two more decks, the all-op deck and the cargo hull. So I suggest you just have a have a wander down into the all-op deck. Yeah. All right. Boom. So there is a big blood pool there. But see straight away. Um, Someone is very dead. Did it. Dead it did. Dead it did. And there's some blood splotches around here as well. Okay. 
so. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Okay, well, let's not just go on a wander. Let's follow the blood. Oh, but it just sort of stopped here. Okay, so someone's body's been moved? Well, no, you follow the blood, Lydia. But it's... The other way. Oh, <laughs> what? The blood, blood can be trailed in two ways, right? But it just stops. Does it? Keep going. Oh! <laughs> I didn't realise it. Uh, I didn't realise it bent around the corner there, right? Uh, I'm very slow. Okay. So this looks like someone was injured and slowly bled. Slowly bled and then massively bled out. Well, uh, no, but look, this is like, oh, you see, it's like someone was was Dribbly. injured somehow. Ooh. Like they got dinked or winged or something and then they hid in the back here. They're, they're two bodies Oh, here. I see. Right. That's where the main thing happened and then they sort of crawled off and dribble, dribble, dribble. So there are two bodies down here and this doesn't look like it happened a long time ago, but maybe this did happen a while back. Okay. Uh -huh. Bear with me. Uh -huh. And because because of how difficult their bodies are to find, maybe yeah. people didn't realise they were dead around here. Because they're hidden around the, like, it, Mike couldn't even bloody realise there was a corridor down exactly. here. Exactly. How are I supposed to find them? All right, let's have a look. <laughs> Heavy breathing. Okay, so this guy died somehow. How did he die? Did he get stabbed through the wall? Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> is that like a she she lob or whatever they're called? <laughs> is that a gigantic spider? Well, they're having a horrible time on this ship. Uh, did he just get stabbed through the did door? Did the spider, like, stab him through the... I reckon someone went to shoot the spider and it went through the wall and caught him. Can we get round the other side? I think it was see? an accidental death. But there's already blood here, look. Oh shit, yeah. So did he already limp all the way down? Oh, I can't go any further. What's through that oh, door? Hello! Oh, he's looks like he's a bit cowering. No. Hmm. Huh. All right. Okay. All right. Interesting. So this is opening a new chapter. New chapter. Soldiers of the Sea, chapter six. So this was actually just before the doom happened there. Before the squid, there was a spider. Mm-hmm. Okay. Big old spider. Others were prison. Who is this? I don't know. See, I think he was accidentally shot by someone shooting at the spider. Okay. And he was on the other side. But That could have happened, yeah. But I probably, uh, yeah. It sounded like it, didn't it? Do you want to... Yeah, if you click on the... Um, on the, on the, the or should I text? Yeah. yeah. They make for the Lazaretti secure the hold. Someone shoot the damned thing, which makes me think someone shot it and he was on the other side. I think he probably was, yeah. So... Yeah, I think he was probably... Can I say... But, like, accidentally... Shot. With a gun... But it's unknown. I don't know who did it. We don't know who did it just okay. yet, do we? Okay. Location of the corpse. Gun store. Let me just have a look at this. Oh, guns on. Okay. All right. But there are all these people down here as well. Interesting. Okay. And that's the guy who lost his arm. Okay. Oof. Oh, so he doesn't look very healthy. Oh my gosh, I just saw the spikes. <laughs> oh, maybe he's dead as well. I think he's very he's dead. On him? He's got to be very. He looks like he's pinned to the wall by the spikes. Oh, fuck. He was spiked. Okay. So is that one body there or two? I think it's. It looks like two. It looks yeah. like two, but maybe that is only one because there's one. Skull, oh, I see. That's one his, rib. Like, yeah, that's his that's top his half and that's his bottom, bottom half. half. It just looks like there's a lot going on. Okay. So do you reckon he ran down there to hide? Like it, at the beginning, it sounded like wall? someone was like, like hiding, like, you know, holding their breath sort of. Maybe he ran away from the spider because he was scared and then ended up getting shot anyway. By accident, but still. 
Oh, it's gonna do that little swirly whirly. But yeah, because it was definitely sounded like someone was hiding, like scared. All right, Jesus. All right, this guy. So this guy's been spiked. I've got you. Don't move. I'll get you down. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, so it looks like they've killed they've the killed spider. killed the here. spider. Or at least one spider. There's this guy there. He's, He's got the sword. This guy's pouring water? water onto it. There's a dead guy there. Dead guy. Is it on? No, it's not fine. Who's this guy? This guy. Oh, is this the guy? That's the bosun. That's the bosun. And he's asking for a gun. Yeah, give me, a, give me a gun. Is but he he's being passed a gun there. He's being passed a gun, and he's still critically got both of his arms. So maybe he's the guy that shot. Oh, the through the wall and ended up accident. Oh, but look, this this blood dribbles off over here as well. And then what happened to the guy who was spiked? So, so the guy who was spiked saying, oh, I'm going to help you down. I'll right? help you down. But he's clearly dead. He's dying. He's dead. Right. So that spider went. Fired spikes. Spikes off. And this guy's got stuck to the wall. He got spiked. He got spiked. Okay, so it's there. Here's I think being spiked is a actually one of the ways to die. Yeah, I think I saw it. Is it? Oh, is it? Okay, cool. Uh, mm. So like, spiked, yeah. <laughs> By a terrible beast. There we go. That's a bad way to go. Oof. We definitely have no way to tell who that guy is, so no. we're not going to worry about him just yet. You Although he is wearing like an apron. Could be like a. Oh yeah, like he's um, could be like a chef's chef mate or something. Or something like that. Right. Right. So we know there's else. another dead body yeah. because we saw it on the ground. Okay. Hmm. Mm. All right. Okay. I'll help you. I'll help you with the controls. Thank you. While we, while while we play I like funny, funny spinny business. <laughs> so in this big pool of blood, there's a horrible dead Ooh, spider at least. Along with a dead guy. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. You just love that sound. Oh, Christ. Right. So oh, was, so there is a fire. So they burned to death. Right. Together. Oh, my God. That's really horrible. Okay, so that's why he's throwing water down. Because they. Because there was a fucking there was fire a, here. There was a bloody fire. He's this guy is looking maybe? like a thing's happening. What's going on down this Oh, end? two, two dead, dead guys people. there. This guy's pointing a gun down this way. But we can't go down there. Oh, but there's spikes here as well. And this, so is this guy. So, I, so there maybe is more spiders down there? Yeah. Like, what's oh. this strip? That's just a bit of like oh, that's tubing, just, or right? Something. Okay. Um, this guy's got a gun. This guy's got a gun. No, he's, this is the bosun. He's reloading. The bosun's reloading. He's reloading. This guy's stabbing at the beast, but this guy caught this poor guy's on fire. So who is the guy on fire? Just right-click on him. Who are you? Tab. All oh, right. Okay. So oh, he's I've just. Sorry. Sometimes it's nice to just see who yeah, is dead. Visualize. Sometimes it's just nice to see who's dead. <laughs> Sometimes it's Lovely. just what you want to know. <laughs> so this poor fucker. God, I think we he's don't know the who worst he is. Actually, all of them, actually. But he got fucking burned. Set on dead. fire with a giant spider. Poor guy. Okay, burned to death. Oof. <laughs> Christ. Okay, so <laughs> he's been burned. Where is he on this? He's this guy. So he's. Right. So he's just one of the sort of... He's on the main group of guys. Yeah. Okay. But he's one of them. So he might be some sort of authority figure, or at least like a, a mate or a midshipman or something. But there was loads of other dead guys. There were uh, two more dead guys down the other side. Yeah, here, weren't there? Yeah. Okay. These guys look like they died together. That's so romantic. Or at least in the same moment. <laughs> <laughs> Boing. Boing. Thank you very much, Jeff, or Geff, says, uh, <laughs> I think it's Geff. I was not feeling great this morning, but watching Lewis and Olivia has wow. cheered me right up. All right, all this murder is just what someone needs. I, honestly, this is one of the best games of the year. Love it. Uh, thank you, Stanley Sturkin. Thank you, Sudura. Thank you very much for buying the bundle. 
keep going, Lydia. I'm, I'm oh, sorry, sorry. I was, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Okay. Thank you, Darkian Maker. Find the bundle. We're no use. Oh my god, did they got their heads cut off? Oh, okay. Yeah. They were like almost basically decap decapitated by the spider piece. What the hell? Is that a dead person? Oh right, so he's like someone's been like stuck to it? Or is that like a monster? I'm really confused. What is this guy? <laughs> it's part of the monster. It's part of the monster, right, okay. The monster is not just a spider. Right. Okay, it gets weirder. It gets a lot weirder, right. yeah. Oh gosh. Alright, so he's taking a tumble. So these guys Oh, and then he's alright, so he throws the lantern that sets it all on fire. So one oh, he's wearing an apron. He could be the guy that got stuck in the wall. Yeah, he got spiked. Yeah. He? Um and one of these poor guys is probably the guy that got set on fire. Okay. Um Those two guys. <laughs> Got their fucking neck snapped by the beast. Giant Spider Man. That's pretty devastating. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Okay, so you were. How would you say they were killed? Um, were they decapitated? Or were they like. Do you know what I mean? I don't know if they did were, because their, their heads neck? were still. I think it did. I would say they got snipped off. Or maybe clawed, people are saying. Clawed? Yeah. By a I think it's probably clawed by a terrible beast. That seems Either way, yeah. looks bad. Looks bad, man. Okay. And there's more dead bodies. Oh my god, who else is dead? Uh... Oh! Wait. That's the fire. That's the so fire. someone upstairs. Someone upstairs is dead. Oh. oh, there's more than one! What the hell? These things are horrible! They've got like a demon on them. Oh, so you're... You've been spiked as well, basically. Sorry, dude. Sorry, dude. <laughs> it really sucks to be you. So a lot of people fucking survived this shit. Uh, not many, sorry. A lot of people... Died. Uh, yeah. Adam. <laughs> Added 20 bucks to their donation for a total of a hundo. Woo -hoo. Uh, horribly split between wanting to stop watching because I really like to want to play this game myself, but also loving the Lewis and Lydia chill puzzle dynamic. Maybe some escape room content in the future? Oh, mm. do you like escape rooms? You know, I've never done one and I really want to. Have you ever played um, We Were Here? No, I haven't. We should play that together then yeah? in the future. Yeah, that What's We Were Here? It's like a um, two-player co-op puzzle. Where you like help each other through Ooh, the game. Ooh, that sounds good. But I haven't played. Like an escape room, like working out how to get out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. I'm up for that. Come on, boss. No, get there. Hey, All right, I need to listen to that dialogue again. So he said, "Stay back." It's already done for Nick. So Nick, someone. Oh my gosh, he's gonna. He gonna die too. Oh, he, I think there's he was, someone hiding. He was lucky enough to not die. Did he say, like, did he call him boss? Boss, which makes me think it's a, um, uh, like his, you know, like a more important yeah, role. Yeah, assistant or whatever. So this guy, this guy's Is really there a dead guy? Because that dead guy might be Nick. Do you see what I mean? It's too late for Nick. Yeah, they already done for Nick. Can we have a look around the other side? As in? That way. This way? Yeah. Yeah, can we go up? There's the other Oof. one. <laughs> There's the dead guy. Right, well, he's very dead. So that might be Nick. That might be Nick. Well, well, but this guy is also very dead. But he doesn't look like a Nick, does he? Is someone hiding or... Yeah, doesn't <laughs> look like a Nick. <laughs> he looked like um, one of the, like, um, Formosans or something, or uh. one of the, like, uh, Chinese crew. Sometimes they have, like, some... Um... I want to listen to it again. A demon! Out of the way, beat to quarters, enemy aboard. What's going on? So that's the dead. Stay back. It's already done for Nick. Come on, boss. No, get down. 
Hey, catch. And that's what the dead guy is saying. What's going on? Come on, boss. So who's he talking to? Hmm. Oh. No. It's all right. Oh, yeah, it's fine. Still that round. So there's this multiple dead guys here. Loads that guy's cowering. But this is the... This is the guy who died at this... this I think it's probably Nick. Hmm? Right, you're going to have to follow the... Follow the... Jeez. So this all happened lost. before the beast. So as you can see, the cannons are all like oh, back yeah. in their old positions and stuff. Okay, so it was the spider attack, which they killed, and then the kraken came along. All right, so here's the guy. It was killed by a spear, wasn't it? Oh no, or was it a spider? Spider spider. Oh, we've got to find out. Okay, it was a spider spike. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a spider spike. <laughs> yep. Okay. So they came from the water. God, this is horrible. <laughs> horrible world. Okay. So yeah, they just watched this guy die. That's definitely Nick. Because then they've said, they've yeah. come down the stairs and they said- Let's see if we can find someone called Nick then on the thing. All right. Let's right click. And... Right click and tab. So he's this guy up here. He looks like a Nick, doesn't he? He does look like a Nick. All right, let's So he's probably find. a shitty sailor, I guess, or a yeah. seaman, so from the bottom. Uh, Nicholas, is he a topman? Could be Nicholas Bottrell, yeah. Who else might he be? Is there any other Nick? Oh, I reckon it's Nicholas Bottrell. Yeah, maybe. I think it probably is. Yeah, all right, I think that's him. Uh, yes, sorry, yeah. my bad. Okay. And then when we... Then we when we go get into get a chance it. to say. But it's nice died. to I like naming them, them in this because then you see them every time. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Because then every time you see them, you can sort of look at them and know who they are. It's, but also, you, sometimes you can like flag people up. On so like. The so this guy stood next to the bosun, so he could be the bosun's mate, could but be. he might not be. You know, that's the difficulty. Yeah, right? you don't know. I... But that is a possible chance. Oh no, I. Mm. But we know the I... bosun's mate is French, and we know he was torn apart. I think it's the guy who got. Who got torn in half? I can't remember which one got torn in half. Oh, you think it was um, the guy with the tattoos? Oh, was that the guy? Oh, then I don't think it's him. Because the guy with the tattoos, that doesn't look French, does it? No, I don't think he was. That He can't be that guy then. The There's guy with the tattoos looks like he's sort of a... Where is he? I can't... Why was that to say? Where is he? Um, he must be somewhere. Unless he's wearing like a shirt that covers up his tattoo. Oh, I just realized there's royalty here? Yeah, Formosan royalty. So Formosa is like, I think like Taiwan, maybe? Something like that. So these guys are... We haven't are seen them yet. Right, no. No, they're involved in another little storyline. Right. Okay, I think the guy who has the... I still don't know who this is. The guy who's got the uh, circle tattoos must be wearing a shirt. Okay, maybe. Um, unless well, you, you can like zoom to if you find him in a memory anyway. But oh, yeah. Okay. All right. So who did this? How did this guy die? Um, spider, spider. It was what, what was it? Spiked? Spiked? Was it spiked? Spiked by a terrible beast. Okay. Oh, hang on a sec. Why is it not labelled who he is? Are we looking at the wrong one. Oh. Oh, it's the one downstairs. Oh, sorry. We must have, we must have like panned forwards. Okay. All right. Mm. Where was it? The guy who was upset. I'm just looking at. Oh, wait, it's because we haven't finished this memory. Yet. Oh, okay. All right. Sorry. It's all right. Thank you very much, uh, Dan H. Hey, Lewis, saw a bunch of yours <gasps> in Queen's Square recently. Didn't see you though. Also, you made to reevaluate Brennan. Yeah, I think we we we. we I think we did we it in the wrong. Mutiny. Did I think we? it wasn't mute Brennan who killed that guy. It was like that mutiny was a bit weird. It's, it's we have to just plan it all out in our heads how it happened to identify there's a goat there isn't there there's a, a goat boy a, a little little, little sweet, goat sweet little goat fella um, thank you very much anonymous for your hundo Woo! thank you so much hundo for charity that's a big deal thank you very much Sam Goodridge as well says thank you for the wonderful month of streams you guys are a big inspiration I really respect the importance of the Yorks Girls play some charity fundraising each year 
I hope to take inspiration from you guys in my own endeavors. Sam, let us know how that goes, dude. Oh, is this... This guy flying through the air. Did he fall off the rigging? I guess it would make sense. So that might make him a top man. Um, yeah, well, good luck, Sam Goodrich. Let's know. Uh, thank you, Hank. Happy birthday as well. It's your birthday today. Happy birthday. Uh, happy to get to give to charity mm -hmm. and get some cool games. There's a lot of cool games in the bundle. Mm -hmm. It's worth a look. Have you bought the bundle? Maybe? Yes, I have. What's, what's your, your top pick of the bundle? I really liked um, the game that I played on the with Booth and G, which was like Papers, Please, by this, like the guy who made this. It's oh, really yeah. like that. Uh, Miss Maisie's house injured for the injured sick i can't remember now yeah, yeah this like um um yes it's called like it's I, like a I, long name but it's, yeah. it's kind of like a similar sort of gameplay style of uh, injuring injured mice during a sort of war mrs and whiskers mrs home whiskers for the, home for the sick yeah. that's it uh so I, I there's a bunch of that. a bunch of games by the same guys who've made that actually let's check this guy out yeah okay he looks a bit he doesn't look it doesn't look European. I was wondering how you're going to wear that. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Oh. Shit, where are we now? Are we up on the fucking rigging? We are. Is okay. this lightning? Was he electrocuted? Oh my gosh. Oh my fucking god, he might have been. Okay. Ooh, hit by lightning. lightning. Okay, that's pretty cool. I mean, not for that guy, but, you know. So people... So these are top topmen. Yeah, these are all the other f topmen, top boys. Top boys. Okay, so this guy definitely killed. After all this is happening, giant spiders, squids, like all this awful shit is going down. This poor guy just gets struck by lightning. It's both it's a bad way to go. Is, you know. Is that guy dead on the bo on the left? If you look down, oh. off to the. Oh side. yeah. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Is he okay? That guy there off the side. Can I, uh, I don't. I think he's. Or is he just clinging on? I think, I think it's just shadow, shadow rather than. Um, it's hard to tell sometimes if guys are dead or not. You need to look out for dead guys. Yeah. Especially while this is all going on. Like, I think, like, if you look in sometimes. Like, sometimes it's like at the end of the chapter, it'll say, these guys disappeared. That's what happened before, didn't we? And yeah. It's like, what happened to these so you poor have to people? Kind of figure out what happens. Because sometimes you can't get their corpses. So one oh. guy, like. Oh. Um, he got electrocuted, I think. Electrocuted. Oh, yeah. Which is a bad way to go. Mm, I just wanted to look at... The top men. So a top men. Yeah. So, so you'd assume... There's four Chinese top men. It's one of these guys. Yeah. Let's take a wild guess. Um... Mainsail will hold up. Secure the braces and lower the top sail. Work fast. The wind is alive. Okay. 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 So that might be the end. Oh, the door just opened, didn't it? It's part of the story. Right. So what happened was, Oof. I guess the lightning struck first in the storm, and the spiders look, spiders are coming Those over. are just coming over now, aren't they? Yeah. And um, then the spider spears a guy as he comes over. That's Pete. Nick. Nick, sorry. Nick's there. That's Nick. He gets speared off the, off the rigging. Um, and then... Everyone is panics and runs down to the hold. These guys are just pulling the the, the I guess they're what they do. Are they all like working on pulling the, the rigging. Pulling the rig. So like cause so, so they've hit a storm. So they're trying to to get the rigging sorted. Yeah. Down. And so they're all gonna get. They all see this horrible spider and leg it downstairs. Panic. Someone else. Wait, hold set. Wait, am I being stupid now? He got electrocuted and fell on down onto top. that. Yeah. Okay, so he fell down to that. Some people hid and some people ran down the stairs. Then they had that. Con one of them, other guys, got spiked and said, um, "You know, Nick's gone." Yeah. And he was talking to his boss or someone. Like, watch out, boss. Watch out, thing. boss. Okay, so you got electrocuted. You. He died in the doom. He was the guy who got blown up. He was the guy who got blown up. This is the guy that's torn in half. Yeah. Go with the tattoo. No, there's the tattoos. Doom. 
Okay, I want to... I feel like I haven't really grasped all of this properly, what happened down here. Like, hmm. What's these guys? <laughs> these are the guys who got killed. Oh, yeah, okay. How do I exit it if you I'm just like... find the door. Oh, okay. It's probably just, just down here. Yeah. So the, the top level, obviously, there's the second level with the cannons, and then the third level is where the spiders attacked. Right. They went down the other side of the ship. Um, so there's two sets of doors of, of, of things. Okay. So yeah, this is where the spiders attacked. This is the spiders attack. Okay, so this side got set on fire. This guy got speared. This guy got spiked. speared. This guy... The bosun uh, potentially shot the guy through the wall. Those two guys got their heads chopped off. Oh yeah, they were the decapitated, spider. weren't they? Uh, yeah, the guy Four. over here on the other side was accidentally shot. Through, yeah. Was it? Is that? No. Yeah, I think was it that, was there. Is that the? I don't know. It was around here, wasn't it? And then there's a guy here. Was it around here somewhere? Who's the guy that got? I thought the guy got spiked around here somewhere. Yeah, there was. Oh, I was on the next level. I was on the next level. Um, yeah. So go back the way you came. Go up that set. Oh yeah. So they f were fighting around here, uh, remember, they fought them, and then this is a double set of stairs, so go left. This is a double set of stairs, then on the right, the guy got speared against this against pillar. This pillar. No, there, against that pillar, I think. Mm -hmm. These are the cannon guys, aren't they? Yeah, but I think the guy got spiked in the same one. Oh, there he is, there he is. that's there. the guy who got spiked. Yeah. Um, okay. And he was, and then, then they, then, yeah, so what happens, the spiders came over, they ran down, they spiked that guy, uh -huh. they killed the other guys, and I think they eventually killed all the spiders. One of them, I think, was... That's the mutiny. Well, one of them was killed here, burned to death, and the other one... Yeah, where's the other one? There should be two... The other one was killed. Ah, I think I know where it is, actually. Okay, I can, I can, go, I can, I think I can go a little bit lower, so... This is the cargo deck Let's down go here. Lower. There we go. Let's go. Let's so look around that here. this is one of. If you look at the map just briefly, um, um, you go to like you press Q. Q. And then we go to like. Um, is it uh, this one? This one. Yeah. So the bottom deck is the cargo hold. So that's the lazarette at the front. Someone mentioned talked about the lazarette, didn't they? Didn't they say yeah. something like? Um, yeah, there's something there. Something at the lazarette or something like that. And then obviously all the cargo is stored here. It goes down here. And then there's the boat's store. Captain's cargo as well. So I think if you actually look in the boat in one of these doors, if I, if I just have a quick look around these doors. Mm -hmm. Come on. Okay, Still. that's that's lovely wines. Boy. Delicious winey times. This is like oh. the. So just storage. 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 Sure. Ah. ah! So this is where they dumped. They dumped one of the spiders in here. The other dead spider. Right, okay. But. So you can see how that can go into, Okay. Oh. Corpse. Oh. Poor spider. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Wow. Well, you got him good. So this guy shot it with a gun. But he also as he died. Died. Okay. And this is down. This is yeah. It's down. But there's also this guy who's doing a little bit of a oh, a bit of a shit job at spearing. And there's this guy. He's oh look, just... he's got tattoos. Ooh. Is he Tattoo Man? He is Tattoo Man. There's Tattoo Man. He's pretty unique looking. Yeah, like he definitely. I think you'll, out. you should be able to tell who he is if you look through the um, the manifest. So click on him. Click on this unknown soul. Now, scroll down to like. The, and just scroll down a bit more. So he's, um, he's from a strange place, mm -hmm. obviously. Mm -hmm. And so who who do you think like of all the people like that he might be? Okay, so I'm going to I'm going to take a guess. 
and say that it's Hamadou Dion. Well, so no, he's not black. Oh. Because that guy would be black, wouldn't right. he? If it was from Sierra Leone, because that's in Africa. Right. And that's quite a quite a sort of. I thought it might be because he's the only one from there. Uh, India, Wales, Denmark, New Guinea. So where's New Guinea? Is he is he Maba? He's Maba, isn't he? Well, he kind of looks like he would yeah. be like. Do you know what I mean? He kind of looks like he would be in. To, it's near to New Zealand. Do you know what I mean? He's like. It's he's like Maori. That's like it's Maori, like Maori style tattoos. tattoos yeah. He's got a single word name. Yeah. He looks completely different to everyone else on the ship. Okay. Do you know what I mean? But he's not like Asian or black skinned. Like. Okay. There's probably ways to like other ways to work it out, but I feel like that does make sense. Yeah. I was just thinking like. I feel like that's probably Mava. Like, that's yeah. the way I would think about it. Because he's not a person of any kind of rank. He's not got a hat. No, he's just a seaman. He's, he's often got his top off, which means he's probably, like, a top man. Or at least he's kind of... He seems quite athletic and, like, like fit. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Top men are, like, the better seaman. You know, he's not just a, a grunt. Um, he could be that guy. could be Omid Ghul from Persia. Persia. No, I kind of, I like your um, reasoning because reasoning. the tattoos are very like sort of, Maori. I know Maori's New Zealand's not New Guinea, but it's the same sort of So we've got like, area. you know, three, three guys from England, one guy from Ireland. We haven't seen a guy with an Irish accent or a Welsh accent particularly. We haven't seen any Indians yet. No. Um, okay. That's cool. Let's, let's just say. Yeah. So. Who were we right? We were correct on three of them. So we were correct <laughs> that this was the bosun. Alfred was the bosun. And he was, and he was torn apart by the beast. We were correct about... He was also torn apart by the beast. Maba. Maba. And we were also correct that Henry Brennan was knifed by the captain. So we were correct... He was the guy at the beginning. ...of Henry. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we know that Henry Brennan's correct. Okay. Brennan. God damn Brennan. All right. So, Okay. Back in here again. So we're right at the bottom of the. Oh no, we're right at the top of the ship now. Oh no, we're not in the middle. We're, mi we're in the we're middle. We're at the bottom, aren't we? Haven't we come down? So this must the follow stairs? on from the bit we were just doing. Um. Mm. Yeah. The corpse was moved post mortem. So this is the alternative way to get to this storyline. Okay. Um, I think so. You can open. So this is still in Soldiers of the Sea, but it's like a different part. Okay, a hideous monster perished simultaneously with a brave but unfortunate soul. So this guy was also uh, speared by, oh no, spiked by a terrible beast. Probably. Um, so the reason that we're detecting this memory is because the, his like blood was in the claws of that beast. Oh, and so right. And so it's like tracking. I see. That's what the compass is picking up on. Rather right, okay, because his body's not there. Okay. Rather than the, the dead spike beast thing so did he like get thrown overboard or i assume his body was just, like, just removed yeah okay okay we still oh the door's open all right yeah let's let's get, let's get out of here let's get out of here except run away okay okay so we've, we've got a lot of info to go on and that is actually the end of this section, I think. Oh, is it? We did that whole bit. So this is like chapter six. Um, that means all the bodies are, the people who died, we've seen their bodies. We've seen all the There's dead no people's bodies. Okay. Um, it's still, oh, it's moved along. We were like here, weren't we? So now we're here. We're closer to the Canary Islands now. Yeah. Um, okay. Hello. <laughs> all right. Uh, Let's leave you. And I just want to look a bit more down here because there's probably going to be more shit going down on here. Um, or is this just untouched cargo? Hmm, you're padlocked. That's interesting. Okay, can't see anyone in there. Oh, Ooh. what's this? This is the... So Very leg. few remains. It's a leg. Yeah. Keep pressure here. Hold him down. Yeah. What madness is this? Twenty years, my steward, and never a doubt on your sanity. 
Explain yourself! Those ungodly beasts carry a curse! Throw them back or doom us all! Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? <laughs> We've been in worse spots. Where's the rest of his leg? So, okay, what have we got here? So there's a guy Someone was lost Welsh right some of there. his leg. There's a bit of blood there. We know where his leg is. It's around the back it's of that bloody other end of the cargo bay. So, this is the guy being hauled away. This is the guy who's, like, crazy now? Yeah, right. he's, he's the steward. So he says, 20 years my steward. 20 years my steward. And never a doubt on your sanity. And now he's kind of lost it. A Who's bit. this, this guy? Is... No. So just hold down, right click, and press tab. Oh, so that's this the is the bosun. Yeah, this is the bosun. So, the bosun so he's there. ready to, he's going to tie... Was he going to tie this guy up? We don't or? know. Oh, no, it's, it's because he's to stop him bleeding out. And this guy's right. obviously the surgeon, because the surgeon here has got his bag. See? And that might even be just a, a, a crib crewmate. It might be the surgeon's yeah. mate. See, he had the doctor's bag. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he's... So he's done an amputation there. Yeah, and he was saying, oh, no, John, you'll be yeah, all right. It'll be fine. I've seen worse. And then the bosun's coming in. I'm guessing... A, was it called a torna, torna, torn, tourniquet? Yeah. yeah. Like he's going to wrap it up so it doesn't bleed out. We don't have, what happened to him though? Why is his... Who is this and how did they die? I mean, I'm guessing he bled out. Well, it says his name was John. Oh, right, okay. It says, now, now, John. Now, now, John. Right. So So it could be John Davis. But he doesn't look be... like he's that important. Well, scroll down there. John, John, John. Are there any more Johns? John, 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 John. John, 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 John. John, I reckon he's more likely. To... Oh, he's Welsh. I heard a Welsh accent. Okay, definitely so heard a Welsh he's accent. Definitely that guy. Okay, then. so he's this guy. It's not really an option for bled out, is there? I mean, I guess. Uh, well, he's lost his legs. So maybe he was torn apart. Torn apart, I guess. By an unknown attacker. Yeah. By a beast. Do we think it was the beast? We don't really know, though, do we? Well, do you think it's the beast? Well, I, well, maybe, maybe some sort of beast. Well, I guess it has to be because. Well, but then no, but then if the surgeon oh, yeah. amputated his leg, then well, no, but he's like, where's the rest of his leg? And we found his leg on the other side of the ship. Oh yeah, that's a good point. All right, well, I'll say beast. I think he was killed. I mean, we can have a look. We can have a wander around at the yeah. scene a bit, maybe. Okay, keep pressure here. Hold him down. What madness is this? Twenty years, my steward, and never. Oh, I think that guy. Attacked that guy. The crazy guy attacked the guy on the floor. Oh, maybe then. Okay. Keep pressure here. Hold him down. What man is this? 20 years, my student. Never doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. Ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw them back or doom us all. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may have on his senses. Come you on. You might be right. Eradara, you fools. All's fine, John. Been in the worst spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? So, Eradara. So, that sounds like Swedish, Danish, something Eredara. like that. So maybe the steward is from that country. Okay. So you can now walk over to him and have a look and see if you can identify the guy who's being dragged away. Okay. I'm just going to... You can change this yeah. back to unknown. I'm going to say uh, unknown. And maybe put that back to unknown, unknown as well. Unknown, yeah. We, 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 don't we know who he him. is, but I'm just not sure. Oh, there's another body. Come on. I want to do this. That guy at top. So he looks like a steward of some description, right? I would say he is Sweden. Could be this guy. The captain steward. Did, did it sound like the captain talked he said, to him? Oh, it wasn't the captain, but he did say he'd been my steward for 20 years. I think it might be the captain. Do you think it is? Wait, well, it quite old. Let me look at... Because there's the who's captain. Oh, it's the captain. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then that's the captain steward. Yeah, my bad. All right, uh, yeah, okay. I didn't realize it was the captain talking, okay. But that's interesting to know. So now we know who he is, Yeah. which is cool. So he's been with him for 20 years and now he's suddenly just gone a bit loopy. 
and potentially kill that other guy, but I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, is there any way we can identify this guy with the bag as well? Cause, cause the doctor. I feel like he's got to be the surgeon, right? This guy. The guy the, leaning, the witch, kneeling down? Exactly. The witch one, then. Maybe we can't yet, then. I feel like it'd be the one... Doing the surgery. Doing the surgery on the floor. But then this guy's got, like... The waistcoat looks quite doctory. There's doesn't three it? of them around him as well, so actually there could be. Any one of could them. Could be any one of them. Let me see where where's he on the thing. He's that one. He's, he's up top. Oh, that wouldn't be the doctor, would it? The one dancing. It makes me think it's this guy. First time. He's wearing fancy clothes. Yeah, he and looks... he's there. Whereas this guy on the floor. Is like, looks, he's not a doctor, is he? Who knows? I don't think you, we can't, well, it's difficult to make these decisions, isn't it, at this point? Maybe there's more information. It, sh and his guy was shot by a gun. By a man. I think this is the doctor. I'll tell you, I just want to see. No, oh, my bad. Uh, go back, go back. I just want to see. Surgeon and a surgeon's... I reckon it's Henry Evans, but... Okay. Not exactly sure. Yeah, I reckon he stabbed... He, he cut his leg off. Because look, there's a sword on the floor. There's blood. He's being dragged away. Okay. You reckon he was sort of cut by that... Yeah. By the, the steward? Yeah. Okay, maybe he was then. Maybe he just went mad. And has gone a bit loopy. All right. How do I? Oh. oh, you could just end the. Um... Yeah. So he's doing his tournament. Where's this other dead body? Let's find out. Is it upstairs? It must be. Yeah. It's okay. Oh, what's going on Ooh. up here? These guys are being held back by. Being held someone. back. He's saying no, no, no. They're taking something upstairs, and this guy's dead. Oh shit, I didn't even realize there was all this shit going on. Oh my there. god, there's so many different storylines going. So you're, you're being led from the, 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 the leg, which was found behind this other bit, which is a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah, why is the leg all the way over there? So there is an interesting storyline, actually. One of the... Um, one of the it's not really actually attached to this, but one of these barrels hmm. has a dead body in it. <gasps> really? Yeah. Well, that's cool. Because that sometimes they had to do when they were at sea. They, if someone oh, died yeah. at sea, they pick put them in a barrel of of pickle. Pickles, so they wouldn't the rot, and then give them back to the family. Yeah. So you actually do have to follow this thing with your mouse. Mm. If you don't, it just sort of stops. If you keep, even though it takes you on a bit of a wild goose chase. All right, here are you. Thank you, Ed. Uh, really enjoyed the streams this year. They've been great. Thank you very much, dude. Oh, my fuck. Oh, my fuck. Died. What? Okay. I'm not even sure what's happening now. Right. Oh, what my is, God. Is that a stretcher? What is that? Is that a stretcher with a dead body on it? And then they dropped it and it smashed this guy in the head. What's it on that stretcher? Is that? I I have no idea. What is that? What? I don't. Oh look, he, look at what he's got in his hand. A mug of. Oh, that was a mug of coffee. It's a hammer. What's in that room? What are you doing in here? Oh, so he. These are the blacksmith people. Or. Carpenters. Carpenters. Yeah, that's helpful to know. Okay. Uh, most incompetent crew of the century. But that's the kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> most incompetent crew. <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> Who is this and how did they die? Well, he's just got smacked on the head. He was um, crushed. Crushed, yeah. By cargo? cargo? By all in cargo? I don't know if they'll count that as right, but... Kind of looks like what happened. I, he definitely was crushed, wasn't he? Like, like as far as yeah, as far as there's that no, goes. There's no speech. Sometimes it, the the game does allow you to have like multiple options. Oh, okay. If they're like, if they're similar, similar or it's like uh, yeah. slightly ambiguous. 
So it will like, for example, like speared and clawed and stabbed are all like similar it's enough. enough there. Yeah, so the game won't pen penalize you if you're not incredibly specific sometimes. So this guy and this guy, this guy's got a hammer and this guy is doing a saw. He's spiked. Goat spiked. Ah. So he could be the carpenter's mate or the carpenter. They're both Americans. Mm, I wouldn't know which one would be which. Um, Does this know, is there any indication as which is like which one's in charge? The main one. Uh, I mean, their names could be either. One of them's Winston, one of them's Marcus. I mean, he looks maybe slightly more authoritative because he's going out to sort of to investigate what's happening. And then this guy is just carrying on with work. This guy's like doing the work, whereas the other guy yeah, maybe. Yeah, I'd know. say he he probably is the the main carpenter. Man, wait, mate is in, is working while boss does nothing. Maybe. I think that's pretty much how the 1800s work. <laughs> right? And there's this uh, guy. This guy. He looks like a guy who we know how he, that he's dead. Is he the guy who got speared? Yeah, he's the guy in the apron who got speared. Spiked. Spiked. It's he got spiked, spiked. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Which one was that? God, there's been so many people that... Oh! Guy spiked up against the wall. Against the wall, right. Yeah, that guy. Okay. So, uh, you're just... Crushed. You were crushed by you a were beast. crushed. He was one of the cannon boys. You were... God knows what is happening with this. You are an idiot and dropped him. This is John, John Naples. Naples. John. How do John. we know his name's John? Oh. He was the guy who got his leg. He was the guy who had his chopped leg chopped off. off. By the other, by the Captain Steward. Potentially. Potentially, not exactly sure. Who are you? You are unknown. Oh. And you, can I see you? Yeah, you are. You were shot by a gun, by unknown. But we don't know who shot you. Or who you are. Or who you are. Hum! Who's that? Who's this guy? He looks old. I would say, yeah. He, look <laughs> he is this. Oh, he's the artist. Oh! So he drew the picture. Oh, I see! Oh, that's cool. So he's not in the picture because he drew it. He drew it. <laughs> ES. Okay, well, that should be easy enough to work out who he is then, because can't I just find someone who has the initials ES? ES, ES, ES. Could be Ed. Oh, yeah. There he is. Easy. All right. Okay. What is... Oh, it's a dead animal. Oh, so that's why it's glowing a bit? So you can use your compass on it to find out when the animal does. Oh, that's cool. But that's a different thing again. That's not for this one because we're it's currently... A different story. Yeah, we're currently following the death of other things. How do I... How do you get... Oh, yeah, I didn't realise oh, right. this person's death as well. There's a guy dead up there. We didn't even see that. I didn't... I thought, they, I thought he'd fallen over. I didn't realise he was dead. <laughs> Crap, thank you to Limmy has donated it. Is it the actual Limmy? <laughs> I don't think so, but keep up the great work, guys. I love Limmy, by the way. Have you seen Limmy's stream? He's very I love his streams. They're so bizarre. They're really like original. Like a trip trippy and like yeah, yeah, very original. He's a very good guy. Yeah. Very impressed with his attitude towards like being creative on a platform. It's very cool. Limmy is dead. Oh no. Is no one watching Limmy anymore? Is he given up? Is he waiting for Christmas? He's Does probably he away for Does Christmas. Does he quit? No. He was too. He was too, too high octane. Like, it, like I was watching it really late at night once, and he was playing The Walking Dead season two, and he just kept doing all these weird cuts and like strange, sort of interlacing stuff, and it felt like I was having some weird sort of drug trip whilst I was watching. I think he's got one of those meme decks. Yeah, so he like can just interlace all this like. I love I love the stuff. meme deck. It gets you, you can just if you program it up to do all your crazy shit with it. You can do some pretty So is that stuff. body the one? Sorry, is that body there? Oh, so this is the body, but it's not... How did he die? Letting me... Oh, it is. Sorry, my bad. Okay. So he died... How? Like... Oh, 
Give him tea and I can fry a solid meal, boys. Have a meal. Take it's it an slow. animal? One sick, gentlemen. There's a free shell here. Let's have a look. No, get back. Christ. Holy shit. So this was the body in the stretcher? This is a... Uh... <laughs> what is this? Is this part of the... Spider thing? What is that? It's another weird fucking creature. Right. I don't know where they got it from or what it is. Yeah, what the fuck is it? Oh, there's loads. Okay, so this is just like everyday stuff is going on up here. Well, I don't know. So we have a look around. Is it? So these guys are saying throw the bodies throw overboard. Throw the bodies overboard. Oh, are they stealing stuff? Oh, oh no, this is not everyday stuff. <laughs> There is plenty of shit gone down up here. There's multiple dead guys uh, up there. And it looks like they're stealing stuff. Is this the mutiny? I don't know. No, this is way before the mutiny. This is way before the mutiny. There's 28 people on this. Oh my God. In this scene. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> how do they. Oh, okay, all right. Who is this? I don't really know how this guy died. So click on the thing. So, clear the deck, move the boat to stay and throw the bodies. So he said, hey there, what's this given to me and I can fry some solid meal, boys? He's a chef. So he's probably a chef. Uh, then he said, one tick gentleman, they're pretty shallow here. Let's take a look. So he no. pulled oh. back the covering. And the thing went, bah! And it whipped him. And he, and he died. And then it dropped and smashed into someone else. And crushed him too. All right. So this guy is most likely the cook. Yeah, there's only one cook. So... He sounded English, didn't he? Sounded he sounded English. There's no, like, cook's help. There is a butcher, but I feel like... Oh, yeah, that's true. But he didn't have he an didn't, Irish he accent. He didn't have an Irish accent, no. All right, let's, let's take a pun and say it's this guy. And he was, I mean... I think he was clawed just... Clawed or clubbed, clubbed or... By, like, by a beast. beast. That's what I think. Yeah. Because it was... Looks like he just kind of got smashed around the head, isn't it? I think so. Chat? Yeah? My name is Chef. They think the apron guy might be the chef. My name. Oh, the guy. I think. I think. I think this is the right. I think this is. This has got to be the chef, isn't it? Yeah, he might have been struck, but clubbed is, seems oh, seems reasonable. Okay, so there he's having a ponder. So that is the captain there. Oh no, that's the first mate there next yeah. to him. That's the first mate. I don't know who that guy is. That's the. That's captain. the captain. So the captain is talking to the first mate and this guy. This guy. This is a, this is another mate, perhaps. Perhaps this is is that the is that's another. That's a mate. Recognize him. He's um. He was shot. He was shot. Oh, he was friends with the bosun downstairs. Right. Okay. So we we haven't seen this top hat guy before, have we? No. But he looks he, like he's he's telling the guys to fire. He's saying fire. Okay, and he and was he was shot shot by the cannon. So he was down. Oh, the he was the guy that got the beast hit it and it went off and smushed him. Yeah, that that or, or I, the, I think he was shot by a cannon. The cannon going off. Right. Okay. So he might be like something to do with gunnery? Question mark. Probably because he's yeah he's going but but it's hard to say at this exact moment. So they're having a chat. There's nothing over here. This guy's just chin. Looks like so they're not stealing because the captain's right there, so that was wrong. They're definitely loading. But they're loading the treasure it up. Chest or Have they just pulled something. it out the water, or are they putting it onto the chest? That's a good question. I meant the boat. Well, I think because it's coming. Yeah, is it coming downstairs or going up? Was it going up? And then over here, what the hell has gone on over here? Looks like another That's spear. A spike, isn't Spider it? spike. Okay. Yeah, I think it is these guys. So yeah, it's these guys, okay. Is it both of them or just one? Ooh. I still gotta find out. Um, oh. So we have to go up and find them. Uh, Lily donates the 
bundle. Um, I wasn't going to get the bundle this year, but I bought it every year and it felt weird not to. Thanks again for the generous bundle. Lily, thank you very much for picking up the bundle. I'm glad, I'm glad you did. Thank, thank you, you, Lily. Thank you, Jonas. He says, what is Yogg's cast? Well, great question. Lily, do you know the answer to that? Uh, what is Yogg's cast? It's hard to define yeah. something so powerful. Uh, thank you, Jonas. And thank you, uh, yeah, thank you, Adam. Thank you, Hank. That's all of our donations. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna have to stop our speaking. We are. We've got it's two. Do now. My God, got to get ready. What do you think? Got I've got to eat this thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've got to eat something as well. Yeah. So yeah, we're gonna go get that room set up. Mike's gonna join us. Shin's gonna join us. Mark Humes is gonna join us. Um, this has been we've really just hit 3. fun. Three point two million as well. Woo! Amazing. This one's for all the murdered people in this game. We did yeah. it for you, lads. 3.2 million. That's a big fucking, big fucking amount awesome. of money for charity, guys. Um, well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for joining us on our streams after Christmas. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do this again. Um, um, if you're around, Lydia, and you want to play more of this, maybe over the new year when people are still straggling in, we could. I would love time. to. I will be around. So let's, let's play know some if, more. if that's something you guys would want to watch. Yeah. Otherwise, we'll see you. In five see minutes. you in a little bit. Bye.